Hey, Ninja Bell Reviews. Thank you, man. Thank you for tuning in. I'll be on in about six minutes here, just getting some things together. How you doing this evening, man? Any good pickups today? Oh, that's no fun, man. Sorry to hear about that. Dang. I'm glad we don't get much snow down here. Sorry for you, man. Damn. And are you happy with it, man? I've mine had a lot of a lot of QC issues with it. Nah, I think I'll pass on the snow. I'm good on that. Oh, uh, I think I got it out here. Let me pull it out and look here. I opened it. I think it was last week or week before last. I can't remember. Week before last, I believe. Uh, got a big box of stuff I've been opening here. Oh, oh, Soundwave. No, you know what? I don't have Soundwave, man. I've got a Megatron and Optimus. I'm sorry, man. My buddy, my buddy brought over Soundwave, though. That's what I'm thinking of. My buddy Iron Ken came over with Soundwave. And his had some real bad uh, smear, like paint smeary type marks on the legs. That's, man, that's bad. You got so many toys, you can't even remember what you have, necessarily. You start mistaking your interactions with your friends' toys for being your shit. <laughs> you, you mentioned it, I'm sitting here thinking I had that shit, for real. Man. In Georgia, we just get the heat, man. We just have hot summers. Other than that, we're pretty cool. We're straight, man. It's not even that bad right now, like temperature-wise. I'm out. I'm out in the shed with a t-shirt. I got a little space heater on in here, but it. I don't really even think I need that. Too funny. It's about 67 degrees in here, according to the little space heater. See, uh oh. One minute running my mouth here. Got to make sure these wires are all nice and tight.
Oh man, I I bet that's horrible, dude. With such a variety on weather, it would seem like there's always something going on, probably. Negative 50? Man, I might... Oh. That's horrible, man. That's horrible. Alright, so. 1030 it is. All together here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Everybody that's tuned in thus far. Another casual toy chat. Saturday night edition. Here at the uh, at the Pimps Plaza, Area 51, out at the shed, y'all. So what's good, everybody? Ninja Bill, we've already me and Ninja Bill already been chatting. Uh, anybody else in here? As always, might spend the first couple of minutes here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and copy up the link and uh, get it around to the to my buddies here. See if we can get some some uh, an audience in here, and I'll uh, share the link to the chat too to join in. Shows on my end, two people. Yeah, and the, the face mask always start off the uh, always start off the videos here since uh, M3 sent me the face mask. Just kind of doing a little plug for him, man. He he makes these fire. Uh, fire face mask. Rob78, what up, man? Appreciate you tuning in, though. Doing the doing the customary plug for M3 real quick for the masks. I love the mask, and it, it's great. So y'all hit him up, man. All right, so we'll take that off and get a little more personal with y'all here. All right, now, uh, yes, yeah, just uh, copying the link and texting it around to anybody that might not have gotten the notification here. All right, so let's get that link copied up. Copy that link. David Fontaine, what up, man? Appreciate you tuning in. How you doing tonight, brother? I had uh, M3 text me on the phone here. I just sent him the link. Love to get him in the chat if, if he would be able to. I'm going to hit a uh, smoke screen us up. Been having fun with him the past two weeks. We've been on chats. Uh, let Bo know here. Sheesh. All right, hit Ken real quick. Let him know about that guy. All right. Rob's already in the room. David Fontaine's in the room. Hit Edward up. Let's see who we can get in here. Got two people right at the moment. Mm, text. Let's text my son and my daughter in case they want to check out. Hit Jay Holler up real quick, see if we can't get him in here. Hit James up if, if he'll even get the message. All right. Cato. I'm going to hit Cato up, see if we get him in here. Oh, that's cool. That's cool, Ninja Bill, man. That's straight. Believe me, I know all about work, man. I'm working all the time. 
I didn't know uh, TF Fan Geek had a had a stream going on this evening. That's cool though, man. Spread the love. I'm not even. I'm not mad at all. <laughs> but let's see here. Who else can I can I hit? Uh, let's hit Aunt Rock up, man. Oh, I forgot to link him yesterday. We could have got him in the chat. That would have been fun. Hit Bo up real quick. Get Bo a notification. I saw Bo in a uh, in a chat. Uh, shit, was it Tales from Teletran? Watched a couple of streams today, man. I can't remember. I saw Bo in one of them though. I need to ask him if he got his bumblebee last night or t today. Actually, he's supposed to get the. Said he was gonna swing by Walmart, and I, was, I had wished wished good luck upon him. So, I think I got enough invites out. We'll see what it do, man. If it brings people, oh, oh, I gotta, gotta hit up Bruce Banner too. I doubt he's gonna come through tonight, but if he did, that'd be awesome too. That's a, uh, oh, that's a group text. That'll work. Let's just hit everybody there. And then we uh, see if we get Pack to come by. That'd be awesome. Uh, so we done hit all those people. Yada 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 yada. And hit pack up real quick. We'll send him the link in case he doesn't check the group chat. And I think everybody is invited. All right. So two people tuning in. Strong possibility one of them might be my wife. If it's my wife, hello, baby. Hey, I love you. I'll see you in a little while here. <laughs> my wife watches the live streams. That's dope. That's dope. That's dope. Supporting her hubby. Sipping on cans of Bud Light Lime this evening. Nice and cold. It's like ice in here, yo. Perfect. My wife must have had them in the freezer. So, let's see, we'll uh, share the link here. Looks like I got five people in the chat. Oh, should be able to post it. Yep. Here's the link. Stu, British B done me. No, we did British B. What up, Edward? How's it going tonight, man? We trying to get British B back on the show, man. Stu, you know how to get all of them? Hey, how's it going, Em? Elm from Transformers and Video Games in, in here this evening. Thank you. What's going on, brother? So we got uh, we got somebody that knows uh, British B, the guy that uh, that trolled me. That looks like a pretty authentic account there. No way to get a hold of him, Stu. <laughs> I'd love to I'd love to joke around with him. <laughs> Oh, you had a long day, Edward. Yeah, yeah, British. Uh, no, I'm, I'm I'm talking shit, talking about getting him back on the live stream, smoke screeners. I was talking about where he at. He don't want to come in the. He don't want to come in the chat. Yeah, I had a I had a dude named British B that trolled me a couple of weeks back. I did a real funny thumbnail, uh, a thumbnail of him on on the video. It was one of the live streams that we did a couple of weeks back. <laughs> Dude just popped in. It was it was pretty funny, man. We had a good time with him, and I've been calling him out ever since that night, man. I subscribed to his channel and I've been poking fun at him and and trying to get him to come back on. We had a good time joking around with him. It was fucking hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he said he was just he came on. He said I'm just sipping some beer, talking shit, talking shit about you. <laughs> Yeah, he was a funny cat, man. 
Yeah, he's got a channel. He's got more subscribers than I do. <laughs> That's the funny shit about it. He's got more subs than I do, and he's just going around barking at people, out there poking at people and shit. What up, Bo? How's it going tonight, brother? Oh, we got Ninja Bill joining in here. What up, yo? Hey, what up, Ninja Bill? Oh, uh, nada. Just chilling. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. Thank you for joining in to the stream. Oh, awesome. Uh, anytime, man. Well, when I'm awake or not working my ass off. <laughs> I can dig it, man. I can dig it. I know. I know how life is. I understand. Yeah, you gotta, I'm, just be glad, I'm just be glad to be back in the work, man. Because I've been off work for six fucking months, man. I was down to bare fucking bones. <laughs> With the COVID shit, yeah, man. Yeah. Oh yeah. It's a mess, man. I'm ready for the year to be over. Oh. It's been a hell of a year, man. Yeah. Both good and bad, but like I said, I, I just been raring to go. And when they called me up, they said, "You ready?" To I was I, before they I, they could even finish the sentence. I'm like, "I'm there." <laughs> what, in, <laughs> what was that Bud Light line? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, M M from Transformers and Video Games. That's what I was sipping. This is kind of my tried and true, man. M man. Always yeah. a pleasure to see you, my friend. Always a pleasure to see you anytime, anywhere. If you guys are not familiar with him from Transformer and video games, he's probably got the most impressive boxed G1 collection you will ever see. And GoBots. And GoBots. Yeah. And and his comparisons, his G1 comparisons with, with, the, with the Euro toys or the Canadian toys and the American toys and the knockoff toys, man, fantastic. Perfecto. Perfecto. Seriously. Go yeah. subscribe to his channel. Check out his stuff, man. And he does awesome video game reviews, collects video games, consoles, yeah. devices, plugins, whatever it is. Seriously, go check out his. <laughs> and he's he's so smooth, man. He's so smooth with the shit, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. smooth with the shit, man. <laughs> yeah, he, he does a, a garage sale hunts too, man, and, and those are always fun to watch. Especially when he's yeah. talking to it's funny watching him, listening to him haggle, and he's like, well, you know, I, I got $2, yep. $5 on this, well, I'll give you, you know, 20 on this. <laughs> what would you take would you take five for it? What would you take five for it or something? And, and almost all the time, they just cave. And I'm just like, man. Well, yeah, you, you, instantly. Gotta, you gotta throw in a horse, a fucking donkey, and maybe a sheep just to get around. Hey. <laughs> It's the it's the whole energy about him. He's just so fucking smooth, man. They're like, okay, they they could be saying a hundred. They could be saying they want a hundred. He's like, oh, would you take five for it. Okay, yes, okay. I guess. true, true, <laughs> true. <laughs> it's it's, it's, it's <laughs> watching those videos. It is, it is, M. It is, man. We ain't being kind. We're being real. <laughs> well, that is kind. That's good too. <laughs> Yeah, he's smooth as shit, though, man. His videos are so well presented and everything, man. It, it's awesome. It is. He's he's really he's really talented with it. He's a natural reviewer, man. Oh, yeah. It's like, in, it's like in his blood or something. He's sick with it. I'm telling you. He doesn't put out enough content, but I, I suspect he's been incredibly busy. That's why. So. Yeah. You know, but uh, he hasn't had a lot of content as of late, but he does put out some great stuff. Check it all out. I'm serious. Well, Check it out. I imagine, oh, like, I imagine like the yard sale aspect of things is probably get is probably a little more scarce. I'm not sure how he's in Canada, so I'm not sure how how COVID is really affecting them like that down here. It's Jesus, like man, we're losing, yeah. we're losing. Man, well, no, well, that, you know, the climate up there is probably getting colder and colder. I, I'm not sure where in Canada, I, like where Dennis lives in Newfoundland, they yet to get any snow. Dennis Baldwin got by. They, I was just talking to him today. They've yet to get any snow. <laughs> and here I am. I got a, a foot and a half of this shit dumped on me. <laughs> I'm just like, damn. And it's all wet snow. So I had to go out. Damn, man. It's probably like 55 degrees here or something like that, maybe. That's crazy, man. Yeah, M, M's just now saying that there weren't many 
many yard sales. Yeah, people are scared all the the public interaction. Twenty two. Yeah. Ready for the year to be over with. It's been a hell of a year for toys, though, man. This has been one of the best years ever for toys. We've got we've gotten some really impressive stuff they've made, man. <clears throat> Let's see. I'm gonna I'm gonna share the link too. See if anybody else wants to join into the chat too. Toys down there in Warmsville. You sitting down there in in Warmsville. Well, you're breaking up. Yards are doing pretty bad this year. Not many have. I don't doubt it. Uh, it's a great time to be a Transformers collector. It sure is, man. Look at everything yeah. out there as a collector. That, that is such a good time. Hey, man. A, so a lot of... For all... All age okay. groups. A lot of the different you, ones, young children, we got the rescue bots. If you want something a little older, we got the prize and siege lines out there. That all works, and we as collectors all. You got the RID yep, lines. Yep. You got the masterpieces. You got you got. And toys in general, it's been a hell of a year, man. Like the the Halo figures, they're nice. The GI Joe classified, they're they're awesome. The, the retro line coming back is... Yeah, we are the, the, so we're just spoiled for, for it. <laughs> yeah, everything is coming out, man. I I even think they're doing th uh, Power Rangers and the Thundercats. Man, it's a great... It's been a great year for all kinds of people. Me. I'm not sure why you're breaking up here, Ninja Bill. I'm not sure what's going on there, man. I don't know if your weather is affecting connection or anything. Oh, you got the heat man out there. Can you stop the questions? Uh, what happened? I, it's break. Yeah, it's breaking up, man. I'm not sure what's going on. on what up, David Hill? <laughs> David Hill, man, How yeah. is it? I haven't seen or heard from you in a bit, but uh, buddy, yeah, it's been about a week or two, man. I I tried to join him in on a on a, one of the streams a couple of weeks and a weeks ago, and it it was going in and out there. <laughs> uh, party people's in the chat. Yep, yep. yep. <laughs> but uh, no, we're spoiled for choice. And, you know, I, I picked up this gal and already reviewed her. And uh, I gotta tell you, I like the scale. Now, the only thing I like about this alt mode, because I think the alt mode is, I love the new detailing on the hood. Okay, that's great. But I love the fact that there are no visible robot bits until you do that. And the yeah, fuck up thing about this, let me tell you, let me tell you about, about this. So, if you look at the molded detail inside, yeah, if you look at the molded detail inside of this right here, right, you'll see some yeah. tab there. Those tabs, these feet originally were designed to swing up all the way in there because it's molded perfectly for the, for the knee and this part of the knee to fit in that groove right there. It's right. molded perfectly. The tabs in there are supposed to tab into the thighs. The slots are in the thighs. And right. the feet should sit completely sideways inside there. However, there must have been a mold change with RC when it was first designed where they either slimmed this section down here or something because now uh -huh. there is not enough room. But you can tell it was originally designed to do so because of the molded detail back here, how the legs work, and all the, the tabs that are in slots that are inside the legs and this rear section. It's there, but you can't get it to work now. I have tried, I have tried, and because of the way the thighs are molded, if the thighs were a bit slimmer, it would work perfectly, but because of the way the thighs are molded, it doesn't work right, it doesn't work right at all, and I have mine mistransformed, as you see, because I think it fills in the front better, as you can see, it fills in the front better, so yeah. I put the arm up, and we'll still roll fine, just and all that stuff, I just put the, it gives it a, yeah. gives it a bit more room. 
Well, I didn't even transform mine last night. You know, we were we were drinking and talking shit. So I, I just opened it up and looked at the bot mode, and I kind of assumed it was going to transform transform like RC. So I wasn't going to go through it. Yeah. But look, looking at that back, you do bring up a good point about it being so hollow in the back. Now you see these two pins up here, though. Yep. I bet you I could come up with something, That's something, a little three D printable piece that just clips on the back to cover up that back part. Yeah, yeah. And another thing I, I'm going to probably do if you watch my review of this gal is I'm probably yeah. gonna, since this thing drops off at, at, at so much as a no, noise, I'm probably going <laughs> to. Our, 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 it does though, man. That thing falls off the drop of the hat. But all the detail right here, which is shared by almost all the other molds, and you got some flaring going on back here. I'm thinking about making adding some white to it because she needs some color. And then this molded detail on the hood adds gunmetal gray. Is what I'm thinking. So or get your uh, a mold mold tile chrome marker. And do silver. It, it's funny that you mentioned that piece falling out, man. I didn't even notice it was on. I was messing with it last night, and it fell out. And I looked on the desk here, and I was like, man, what the hell does that go to? I was like, oh. Yeah, that antenna, man. It falls off as a drop of the fucking hat, man. During the review, it must have fell off three. I got so mad. I was like, screw it. During the re last, last, my last shot of it, it was like my sixth time shooting the video. I was like, screw it. It's off. It's going to stay that way. <laughs> There's a lot of there's a, there's a lot of shit they cram in. Man, this little girl, though. Yeah, she's I got a lot of robot mode, though. Yeah, she's got another a lot of problem. Problem. Yeah, another problem I had with mine is is that you see I have my head not transformed correctly. That's because I had to force this thing because I believe it's a ball peg that's in there. I believe it's a ball peg. But I couldn't turn the head because was, I think there's some flashing in there. What's worse is if you can turn your head, because your head will probably turn easier than mine, you'll notice there's no screws, which means it's glued together the front and back half. Yeah. I see what you're saying. <clears throat> And I heard, uh, I was reading about people that there's some kind of problem when, uh, with the shoulders. Following me. That's probably I can't even get the damn panels open on mine. How the hell do you do this? How the going outside? So, uh, Bo, Bo's asking, can you use Sharpie? The shoulders here? Yeah, they made them backwards. Uh, can you do what? You said your shoulders are backwards? Yeah. The only one review seen of her had the shoulders assembled correctly. There should be a... I think mine might be right. There, if you flip around, there should be a pressure on on the right side. If you have that depression, as Damn, Ninja Bill, you're breaking up. I don't think anybody's hearing you, man. Yeah, mine is born properly. So, the back. See, depression on the right back. So, what up, Kato? Sharp. Please. I don't collect. Personally, I don't like 
Let me go now. Come back in. Yeah, I, I'm not sure. It's, damn, it's breaking up. Yeah, so I think he may try to come back on here. Yeah, yeah, there he goes right there. I'll try to add him in. All right. Maybe be a little bit better here. Sorry, let me hear. So. Yeah, still, still seems like. Right this second, it is. All right. So, as I was trying to explain, there goes that damn antenna. If you see a divot on the front of the shoulder, like you see right there, that's the front. If you see the top of the pin, like you see right on that side, that's the back. You see that, what I'm talking about? Yeah, it's a dip in it. Yeah. That's so the front of it. You're supposed to have the dip on the front. Yep. But the problem is they misassembled the figure, so most people got it misassembled where they're not on the front. <laughs> So does that affect the transformation? Not at all. Not at all, thankfully. Not at all. It works both. The arm works both ways. It's just misassembled. If you care about such things. I don't really care because it works just fine. I'll be damned. I didn't notice that. I thought it was straight. Shit. I know it's damn near impossible to get all this stuff up over. Like to open these panels. I couldn't get them open. The hell, I didn't figure out the. Uh, oh, okay, I'm, I'm reading. Hold on, Dave. Right, David was asking me. <laughs> Damn, yeah, I don't want to say that in the video. So we we had a uh, ninja bill in the chat. He's he's ex he's having bad weather in his neck of the woods here. So maybe it's affecting the connection. Sorry about that. It keeps dropping out. <laughs> That's cool, man. That's cool. I I know you got bad weather going on out there. Switched to my mobile. Um, but yeah, that's what I was talking about. It is is most people don't realize it. You don't really realize it that the sh shoulders are misassembled. Hell. You know, you really start looking at, at the figure, at the instructions, and the box art, and other reviews, and then you notice, well, wait a minute. And so far, Kato's is the only one who I've seen that doesn't have misses. You know, still, it doesn't matter. Oh, he got lucky. <laughs> he, he, look, I, I think he got that Kato look. God damn it, you know, fell off again. I don't know where the hell it fell off to. That damn antenna on the back always falls off. <laughs> I love I'm I gotta keep an eye on mine too, make sure I don't drop it. Jesus. <laughs> like I said, the thing drop off. But I do like the detail. And uh, to answer the one question about the uh, Sharpies, I prefer not to use Sharpies. I prefer look Gundam markers or paint pens, acrylic paints, uh, a spray. I prefer my spray gun, so my airbrush. But um, that's just me. Um, all of those work just fine. You just gotta, you know, when you're painting something, let, let me, let me clarify by starting from, the, from the very beginning. If you're gonna put, like, say, I'm gonna paint that detail on the hood, all right? I want it to be done metal gray. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to clean the shit out of this. I'm gonna degrease it, soap and water. I'm gonna clean it, fully let it dry. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna sand the area that I want to paint. Why? It's because this is smooth plastic. Paint won't stick to it very well. You need that paint to grip onto something. Uh, um, so right. you want to add, once you've sanded it, you clean it again, and then you start adding very thin coats. You don't slop on paint. Never, never, never. Why? It's because you lose 
molded details in slot paint. So you right. want to add several thin coats until you achieve the look you want. Right. That, that's just standard. That, 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 that's my suggestion, my best suggestion. Once you do that, then I, I myself always add a, a top coat or a clear coat or something um, right. to seal that paint there because I want it to stay. I, I don't want it to chip or anything, uh, um, you know, if I'm transforming it or something. Speaking of the transformation, any joints you paint are going to chip unless you do sanding. Why? It's because that will give you room to have that paint not get chipped when you're transforming it. Because right. when you add on a layer of paint, you're adding on more thickness, a, a millimeter or half a millimeter or whatever thickness it is, you're adding to what's already there. So you're going to chip paint if you don't sand down properly. Sometimes right. you just can't sand areas because it's really difficult to get to or you haven't fully disassembled a figure. Like some people I know don't like removing pins uh, um, and that's okay. Try to disassemble figure as much as possible and paint it as best you can. That's my advice for customization. Uh, um, yeah. But it works. It really, really works. And show you a, one of my best customs. I'll be right back. Yeah. <clears throat> Getting some painting lessons here, y'all. While I try to figure out how to fuck the transform the leader one. Got her legs kind of folded up in here. Like, take this for example. This is an alright I made Thundercracker. And it is my custom and fully transformable. Works. Does everything it needs to do. Yeah. And he looks super awesome. And yeah, it looks great. It's like it, it looks like it came right out of the package, which you know what I wanted it to be. Yeah. How long did it take you to paint it? Uh, I actually did a video on this. It took me about a week and a half, two weeks, uh, um, allowing for you know paint to dry. Uh, actually, probably more like three weeks total. Yeah, because one thing you got to remember when you're customizing a paint, you got to let that paint fully cure. I see so many people rushing it and rushing it while it, the end result may look good, it won't last. <laughs> yeah. It, it's, and it's got to last. It, 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 it's got to last. It's got to stay looking sharp through through the ages. And like I said, they didn't make a thunder uh, thunder crapper, thunder cracker, and <laughs> no English skills. But so, you know, Skywalk, they make the first three, but none of him. Not even an exclusive, so I do my own. And then I, because I did so well, people uh, asked me to make them some. And so I ended up making like six of these guys and shipping them out. Oh, wow. And I added, I added my own flares to it. So, you know, mine would look way different than what most people expect. Got some nice big giant chrome stickers on there. <laughs> and it, it, it's really cool but you've got to be patient when patience is probably an imagination are probably the first tools you need when you're working with on, or planning on doing a custom absolutely all the time it's just you got to be patient yeah any, nothing good comes out of rush got to take yep. time so I mean it's even like, I'm not sure how well this will show up on camera. It's like, I've even customized these little micro masters, you know, some of them, because I, I wasn't satisfied with how they looked. Like, I even painted the inside of <laughs> the barrels. <laughs> I mean, oh, there, there's a, I added yellow to those rear windows. I'm not sure you can see that. Yeah. Right there, those little windows, I, I added some yellow to it. Some, I added some chrome to the side yeah. there. Chrome and lights to the front. I'm gonna add lights. Well, I got lights in back already. So, you know, I uh, I got tired of this guy looking plain. I haven't done really much to Big Daddy yet. 
I gotta review these guys. I got a ton of MicroMasters and Target Masters. I gotta review. I haven't even done my Hotlink review. I've had Hotlink for almost eight months or so. I haven't even reviewed it. But then I got the idea to customize his Target Masters to with some battle damage to look just like you know they belonged with the rest of the figure. Not finished yet. They're about. Yeah. Well, I, I bought multiple. I bought multiple sets of different uh, the different target masters and stuff, and I swapped the legs, the legs and arms around to make oh, nice. different color combinations and stuff. Nice. Yeah. I did that, I did that I, a lot. I, I want to. Uh, I've got all the stuff to do casting, man. I've got a vacuum chamber and the whole shit. Uh, I want to start uh, tinkering around with casting. And the reason, <clears throat> the reason I initially wanted to do that was for the target masters, so I could start casting them and do it, you know, break them down in different pieces and and cast the different parts in different colors and like have target masters for every one of my transformers, kind of. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I, I I dig that. I can dig that because one of the things that Hasbro has done, aside from all the other BS they've done recently. You know, aside from the QC issues and the not and the over, you know, over promising uh, on deliveries they can't make <laughs> or retailers yeah. selling product they don't have that kind of thing that yeah. hurts the shit out of me. And, and, and but um, one of those things is, is nah, no, I'm not yeah, really angry. <laughs> <laughs> one of those, I'll be cursing every other word. <laughs> hey, hey, this, this is 18 and up right here, man. We drink, smoke, and cuss, whatever you want to do, man. But. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, hold on. Let me answer a question real quick. I see uh, Edwards was at, uh, Edward Fredericks was asking if I have any Transformer tattoos. I do not have a Transformer tattoo. How about neither, you, do, neither do I. I have none currently. No I'm tattoos? Not saying, planning one. I just have none currently. <laughs> okay. I've got a bunch of tattoos, but no Transformer tattoos. Yeah, I've, I, I, I've got quite I don't a mention, few. I just never got around to it. I got to review this guy, too. I love this little thing. That's a. Uh, that's that a. Awesome. Oh, that is. Oh, I was thinking Swindle, man. What the hell? You know, yeah, this, man, this, this is. This is I actually bought a second one just recently because I'm going to customize it into a movie swindle. I think that would be great. Yeah, because yeah, be it, it looks the part of a swindle. You just need yeah, to place your head. So it I got a friend of mine a head for me and um, modding a head. For me. They'll send it to me and then I'll have a nice swindle, movie swindle in, out of this. So, All you'd have to do is paint a little purple on it, probably, right? Swindle was just yellow and purple, I think. Yep, bit bit of silvers here and there, but otherwise, yeah, yeah. And change the head on him. Well, like I said, I have a friend friend of mine who is modding a head and he, on a three D printer, and, and he's gonna print me a head and send me one, so I can you know replace the head on this one for the swindle head, and I'll have a nice swindle, add a nice Decepticon logo, get some purple paint across the front there. It'll look good. Yeah, that would be, be awesome. Hey, uh, welcome to the welcome to the chat, Tom Bernal Jr. Man, thank you for tuning in. I haven't seen the chat lately. I should probably what's going on in the chat. <laughs> David Hill said uh, he's going to bring a, a dark helmet figure so we can crank him out. <laughs> <laughs> But uh, yeah, I mean, I wh who what where uh, uh yeah, but <coughs> hey, oh, dark uh, helmet. Hold on, real quick, uh, Ninja Bill, dark helmet. Are we talking about space balls? <laughs> <laughs> Such a classic space movie. Balls. I don't care who. I don't care what anybody says. It's a classic fucking movie, man. It's hey man, if, they, if they've got a toy for dark for dark helmet, I've got to get that shit, man. I think they do. I think someone did one. I can't remember. I thought I saw someone. Maybe it was someone's custom. I don't know. I can't. Oh remember. my god! I've got to get that. If that exists, man, I got. I need that in my life. I, I, I want. The, I want the space Winnebago. Damn it! I want it as a playset. I want it as a playset. I want the space herpy too. 
Hey, me and my buddy, uh, we have <coughs> we have two flea markets. We have two flea markets in our area, <coughs> and uh, one of the flea markets has an old ass minivan. It's called a, a Tes Tes Tesco, I think it is. And I swear to God, it looks exactly like Rodimus Prime, except wow. the <clears throat> the one that they had was was a uh, was like tan tan colored and brown or something. And me and my buddy, we we always joked about we were gonna buy. Uh, well, I, me specifically, not him. He's not gonna do that shit. But we we used to joke that we we're gonna buy that shit and paint it like Hot Rod and fix it up and drive it. Around. I, mean, I like Rodimus Rodimus Prime and drive it around the city. <laughs> and we put the pipes and everything on that shit. Oh. Pop the trunk, man. Welcome, man. Yeah. Nice Pop, man. <laughs> I didn't see the tail coming in. Nice. nice. Oh, David Hills made a Spaceballs figure. Man, you need to bring that shit for real. We need to we need to mass produce that, man. There's a market for that. Out of all the other stuff I've spent twenty dollars on, I'd spend twenty dollars on a on a dark helmet toy. Thirty dollars. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Get get you one of those uh 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 Winnebago toys like you find up in well, I, I don't know about where y'all live, but where I live they're you know, farm and fleet stores and Norby's and oh they all sell farm equipment uh uh, uh and such toys, you know, like Ertl toys and whatnot. And, uh, I often see Winnebago's in there. I should find some way to attach some sort of engines and wings to the side of it. <laughs> hey, that'd be cool, man. That'd be cool. I'm uh, looking that up now. I'm looking it up right now. I see they've got a Funko. I oh, know. Hold on, not a Funko pop. Where is it? Is it no Thor helmet? Let's look up Dark Helmet Spaceballs collectibles, maybe. Let's see what all kind of stuff they got for. Oh, for Edward, Edward Frederick saying, thank you for the compliment. That Ninja Bell, that looks awesome, bro. Good work, man. He's talking about my uh, 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 Thundercracker custom. Yeah, yeah, it is. It is. You did great, man. Yeah, I was just scrolling back through the chat. And yeah, this is it, folks, in case you haven't seen it. I got tired of waiting on my own R.I.D. Uh, 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 Thundercracker, so I made my own. They never did release one, but I, I, was, I was just like, screw it, make my own. <laughs> and he's awesome. That's so cool. Like, transform it, and I'll uh, show you guys the old look. That looks really good, though, man. You did a great job painting it. Thank you. It, it, uh, it, took, some, it took some time. And effort and all that good stuff. <laughs> oh, I found I found a, a prop. I found one for thirty five bucks, man. Oh, sweet! It's cast. It's a casted toy, though. I would show the phone to the, put the phone screen on it, but it's not going to show right. You can't. It doesn't really work well when you do that. But yeah, thirty five bucks, man. It's not posable, though. I'd like to have a posable. <laughs> That's funny as hell, though. <laughs> It'd be cool as hell, too. Have one. Yeah. Space balls. Make six cent space balls figures, yo. Hasbro, where's it at? Screw Hasbro. <laughs> Somebody yeah. else make it. Somebody. Somebody will make you know a real good decent one. <laughs> well, I, I shouldn't say that because Hasbro do make some good products. I, I shouldn't say that because I, I love I love Transformers as much well, as anybody. Else. Well, you can't wait for Hasbro to do some shit. You take you matters in your own hands. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> take matters in your own hands. Yeah. Say, so, damn you, Hasbro. Say, so, fuck you, Hasbro. I do it myself. <laughs> That's it's true, though. From that major league, from the major league, well, well fuck you, Jabu. I do it myself. <laughs> major league, major league. Oh, the movie, major league. Okay, I'm. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like trying. I tried to think for a minute. Like, what the hell is it? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, buddy, Cal 
Well, buddy that's kept praying, praying to the God that never answered him. Dishes. <laughs> yeah. uh, this shit's this heavy, man. These things are big. Just to give you, give you an idea here, Jesus. That is impressive. These things are big, man. This has got to weigh. This has got to weigh at least five, five, six pounds. Just probably five pounds, maybe. Here's the alt mode. Damn, you did a good job painting that, man. <clears throat> See, I could turn these into some really nice stuff if I had the balls to paint, man. Oh, anybody can do it. They just got to take some, look, like I was saying earlier, first things you need when you want to do customs, patience and imagination. Like this right here is my own. I saw another custom. Somebody did another custom of this, but I changed up what they did, you know, to make it my own. I added chrome, you know, silver where most parts needed to be. That white striping is a lot thinner than what they had. And I added the white striping on the rear fin to give it more color. And I yeah. think it pops like hell and I and whereas their tail rear tail fins were blue I, I made mine black so to give it once again a little it more pops. color it pops out yeah yeah it gives it more like it pops out more detail so I said that this, this is you know when I got tired it's what happens when I get tired of waiting on something it's like I had my Cyberverse jet fire, you know, that green one, that Cyber Cybertron jet fire. I got tired of waiting on a G1 lookalike. So, yeah. you know, I another one customized. <laughs> uh, we got uh, we got JJ Prime in here. What's up, JJ Prime? Review. Oh, JJ. <laughs> hey, everybody in the chat, man. Everybody chat to uh, subscribe to JJ Prime, man. He's he's a busy man. He's in Malaysia and this man's up at all kind of hours of the day repping, boy. Repping on YouTube. Yep. So, but like I said, when you're doing customs like this, you know, it, it just takes, you know, patience and imagination. You got to, you know, know what you want and then you know make it. And this is what happens when you make it. <laughs> and it looked good, too. I was yeah. like, wow. It turned out so much better than I originally thought. That's just awesome, like, man. That's just one of many I've done. I, I I can't do what I used to do because you know, my age. My problem is being old as I am. <laughs> is I'm starting to get arthritis in my hands, so I can't paint like I used to, which sucks. <laughs> hey man, that that's uh, what what did you do? Is uh, uh, are you working right now, or what did you do as work? Or uh. I, I do a lot of farm seeding company stuff. It, Using your hands a lot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, well, no, I mostly, you know, do do the uh, networking side of things, but uh, it's there's a lot of a lot of moving around. There's not much time to actually sit on my butt. <laughs> it's a lot of moving around from place to place, you know, because everybody's got a problem with one computer or another. I got to go out to where they are. Or go out to a field where they're they're having a problem, you know. I'll, I'll have to travel, you know, twenty, thirty, a hundred miles somewhere. Boom, go get there, check out the problem. Oh, okay, fix it. Come back, go out somewhere, go around somewhere, and within the facility, <laughs> it's just one thing after another. It's a long day, and I, man, after six months of not working, I, I'm ha I used to hate it, but now I'm just like, yes, yes, I'll go do that. <laughs> 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 Shit, I hated before. I don't mind doing so much. And when you ain't working for six months, <laughs> he's like, "Yeah, yeah, I'll do that." You, oh, you want me to go clean the shitter? Sure, why not? What the hell? I don't care. <laughs> Give me something to do. <laughs> uh, <coughs> I I work with my hands for shit, man. Since I was man working with like hand on hands, hands, hands on like twenty twenty three. I've been working with my hands steady since 23, and oh, yeah. my shit locks up. Like my my middle finger, my middle finger on my right hand locks up, and I, I like uh, when I wake up in the morning, it's hard as hell for me to pop it open. It hurts when I pop it open. Oh yeah. But once I get going in the day and moving around, I can do normal shit. But starting oh, yeah, off, I do, 
I grew up on a farm, so uh, you know I've been working all my life, and, and and it wasn't until I got you know took took this you know computer work you know and, and went to college for it that you know I didn't work as hard as I used to. I worked longer hours, but I guess I I don't know one's a trade off or the other. I I enjoy farming, something that I always respected, and enjoyed, and I grew up with, and you know even. Even when I, you know, I started doing this shit, you know, this networking shit, you know, I would stay in that communities uh, because just better. It's just, farming communities are just better. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, you big city folks, you know, you could you have all the fun and get all the all the cool toys in your stores, and we get you know rescue bots, but <laughs> you, gotta, yeah. you know when you got to spend you know sixty minutes just to. Go go to a Walmart. <laughs> yeah. One way. <laughs> now there's, there's a lot of there's a lot of agriculture going on in in our area. <laughs> I'm in Georgia. We're in the country now. Yeah. It's all it's country yeah. down here. We got we got deer everywhere on the highways and and <laughs> a lot of especially the area I'm in, man. A lot of a lot of the people own you know several acres of land out out this way. Like there, there's a lot of there's a lot of un un uh, unused land just yet, all around the area I'm in. I'm just outside of the city. Yeah, where <laughs> Atlanta? Uh, Augusta. We're just Augusta? outside. Oh, Augusta. nice. Yeah, yeah, nice. I only been through Augusta. I never. I, I used to live on the uh the west side of Atlanta, um, many 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 moons ago. But um, I love Georgia. I love Georgia. I loved it. Yeah. I liked the Alabama weather, better, to be honest. But <laughs> the weather generally, the weather generally doesn't get too bad here, man. It's a good place to be. Yep. <clears throat> oh, but you know, it, it can be. You, you all get those torrential rains when they happen, though. Shoot. Yeah, yeah, we do get heavy rain. We do get heavy rain when it comes, but. <laughs> Whew, and when it comes, man, get indoors because wow, does it come down. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And every every once in every once in a while we have we'll have a freak winter storm like kind of kind of every ten years I guess. Yeah, but you only get trace amounts though. You know, you get yeah. maybe maybe an inch or two, maybe. <laughs> I'm I'm. I, I remember I remember in '77 I was we had I think 15 foot of snow. <laughs> oh yeah, we never see nothing like that. No, no, no. We don't see anything like that. But Lord, we have some trees. We have some trees break, though. Jesus. Oh, we had a derecho come, come, come through here uh, a couple of months ago, man, and it leveled fields and trees and some homes and just it's almost as bad bad as a tornado. We get those two. We get those. We we get all kinds of tornadoes. And, Spring weather around here is no picnic. Uh, you get torrential rains, lightning storms, heavy thunderstorms, tornadoes, up to 100 mile an hour gust and 90 mile an hour gust and winds. It just it just happened. Uh, on my channel, I do a lot of Transformers reviews of new figures and old figures because I want to show my love of them. I'll, always JJ, just like anybody else, and it's always good. <laughs> I want to remember the time I got them. Absolutely. Yeah, Magic Square RC. I don't think I've seen that one, but then again, I'm not. I'm I I have never picked up a third party toy. Personally, I've had them sent sent some sent to me, but I have okay. never picked one up. I, I'm just I buy the more official lines because they're just easier for me to get. Because <laughs> I mostly hunt in the wild, I don't buy online, so I, I just. It's easier for me to get if I just, you know, can find them. I, I finally saw an Earthrise Prime. Technically not an Earthrise. It's a Netflix Prime. Saw one yesterday. Couldn't pick it up. I was busy picking up some other stuff, and I was like, damn it. But problem is, is it doesn't come with a trailer. Yes, it looks a little bit better than the Earthrise Prime, according to some people. But it doesn't come with a trailer. So I was, like, so tempted to be like, mm, I want it. But no, nah, it doesn't have the trailer. I want the one with the trailer. What's really different with it, though? Is it that much better, man? Well, it, it does come with two uh, 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 battle masters, right? Uh, target, 
you know, the the gold, yellow plastic, yeah, it's ugly as sin, but, but he does come with two of those, and it the paint job seemingly looks a little brighter. I'm not positive of any other differences. Oh, M3 still here. Yeah. <clears throat> Making tamales, drinking beers. Good. Cheers, M3. Yep. Uh, uh, yeah, JJ does pop. Yeah, his channel does pop. Does indeed. Yeah, see, I I don't mind. Here's my here's my stance is oh, shit. I'd rather buy official products over third party products. I can't deny the third party products uh, 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 um, quality generally is way over the top of anything Hasbro has put, put out um, sometimes better than what Takara has put out although recently Takara has sort of gone down hill <laughs> if you know when it, when you look at their MP figures and the quality of those as compared to what third party has been doing even now even Takara is starting to fall a little shy my problem with third party is this: is third party uh, <laughs> or entirely, entirely, and absolutely, can one hundred percent reliant upon its fan base. Without its fan base, it could not exist. Period. It, it, those companies would be nothing but shells that would just fall in the wind because without its fan base. If people suddenly stopped buying third party, they wouldn't exist anymore. They 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 go under, yeah. and, and that's a simple fact. That's not taking away from their hard work or anything like that. I'm just saying that those companies exist solely because of the fan base and nothing else. They they they're not standing on their own. Which brings me sort of sideways to another topic about third party is when a third party company makes enough money to buy its own factories, it's time they consider getting a license to produce official, you know, figures. Uh, you know, actually calling something an Optimus Prime rather than General or whatever the hell other they think of. <laughs> Slapping an auto on, on it or a Decepticon logo on it for a change. You got money enough to buy your own factory, you damn well have enough money to start licensing figures. Because most of the problem with licensing Startup cost is big. I won't deny that. Yeah. And most why most third, my guess why third parties don't license is because of the legal uh, uh, problems that lies therein. Because once you have a license, you have a responsibility to hold whatever the licensee tells you. Like they say, okay, you can't produce this figure. Boom, you're not producing it. It's it's their call. And that's probably why a lot of third parties don't do it is because they don't want to be, uh, 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 you know, stood over by somebody watching over their shoulder and saying, uh, 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 no, uh, no, no, because <laughs> that would limit. It's kind of, it's kind of like, uh, uh, damn. So third party caters to a certain, a certain group too, though, man, because they're, they're, they're more expensive. Yeah, yeah, but like that's what I was saying. They they exist solely and entirely because of the fan base. They yeah. they could not stand on their own because they'd have nowhere else to go. Uh, um, and a lot of people think is is that you know Hasbro has started raising their prices because the third party products are better. No, that's that got nothing to do with it. Look, the Transformers aren't their largest largest chunk of change. It's not even their their the highest their highest grossing IP. I mean, they got other IP out there that makes much more money than the Transformers. They own <laughs> Death Row Hasbro. Records. Fun they fact, have... they own Death Row Records, for anybody that didn't yeah. know. Hasbro yeah. owns Death Row. Yeah, <clears throat> and, and not to mention all their gaming their gaming IP, for crying out loud, they make more money on their gaming IP than anything they make off of Transformers. If people think that Hasbro would go under just because... Of, Nobody's buying Transformers anymore. <laughs> sadly, sadly mistaken and overwhelmingly ignorant. Hey, but <laughs> pardon me. You know, I, I feel like, uh, and and you can, 
I might not know either though, because I only initially all I did was Transformers. I'm starting to get back into GI Joe and dabbling around in some other things now, but no, well, I can't go down that rabbit hole. <laughs> yeah. I wish I. But so, damn, uh, damn, what was I fixing to say? <laughs> Lost your train of thought, huh? Yeah, uh, that's okay. We were talking about third party. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> oh well it'll come back to me if it's important fuck it let's move on <laughs> fuck it let's move on <laughs> so uh so uh <laughs> now, a lot of people not like the side of this line I happen to love this side of this line um next wave of deluxes are coming out and i'm really only interested in one of them <laughs> maybe two maybe a sound wave maybe a sound wave I, 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 take it or leave it but starscream definitely unless it's really i'll have to wait for what watch deluxe for that because he you know that that man will buy a starscream <laughs> anybody will buy a starscream he will buy it up <laughs> So I'll wait to watch his review, and if he, he you know, if he likes it, then I'll then I'll buy one, cause uh, maybe I, I don't know. I, I bought all, all of them so far. Thunder Howl is my most recent one. It's a decent face. Honestly, I know a lot of people in chat probably don't even. Oh, know. I know. I know what I was saying now. I know what I was saying now. Okay. All right. So, go ahead. I feel like Transformers started third party. Like really, I don't. Yeah. I don't have any. It, like no toy line. There wasn't nobody that was <clears throat> that was tr trying to provide, uh, you know, custom parts and shit for other toy lines. Like Transformers has been a big a big spark in in three D printing and three D design and and people you know wanting to create characters that Hasbro was bullshitting on and. You know, you know, I, I feel like Transformers. Yeah, yeah, part, yeah. There was no other. There's no other toy line that was as catered to as Transformers is. You know what I'm saying? Like Transformers, if if you know the right person, anything you think of, you can get that shit made. If you want to, if you want like a, a fucking seven foot tall Unicron, somebody you can commission somebody and they'll make that shit for you. Somebody will make that yeah. shit happen. Transformers. Well, you know, the thing is, is is is. Unlike Hasbro, other companies don't fucking play around with their IP. Bandai, Bandai, you don't fuck with Bandai. You don't fuck with Bandai. Period. You don't make third party shit of Bandai without Bandai. Bandai would, be, uh, would be Dragon Ball Z, wouldn't they? Yeah, yeah. They 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 do not fuck around, man. They they do not you better license their shit, otherwise they will be standing <laughs> on your <the> neck. <laughs> they do not play around. Disney is another person. You don't fuck around with their IP. You just don't do it. Because those guys don't play either. <laughs> uh, we got M, uh, M3. I do believe that uh, Wee Jang did a masterpiece. Uh, I think I think it's Wee Jang. I could be wrong, man. Wee Jang. Buddy, my buddy's got one, though. It's like an oversized knockoff masterpiece star screen. So I, that, that's, that's G1. That's you know, kind of looks. It. It's not a G1 transformation. But. Did Wei Zhang do a G1 star screen? I have Black Mamba favor star screen. I'm not sure if Wei Zhang did a G1. I don't think they did. Um, they're shut down anyway. Um, so it, I guess until they start up with something new. <laughs> until yeah, until until my movement catches on and we get them freed. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be another name for sure. But, yeah. <laughs> we got to get Wei Zhang freed. He can be G G Wang. I heard somewhere it, it, r rumor control has it that another third party company was raided. Uh, uh, um, I I don't know the details or any. I, I just I think I caught a post somewhere and, and I don't know if it's true or not, but I, I heard there was another one that was raided uh, early this month or late last month. I I, I don't know the specifics of it. Damn. If, if anybody out there in the chat does, well, by all means, you know, inform me because I, I, I only caught, yeah. you know, just barely caught the wind of it. So we live uh, in America. Yeah, I dig it. We live in America. We don't know what's going on with it. Yeah. Yeah. Because 
apparently had something to do with a prime figure or a prime look like or something. I I, I don't know. Uh, um, it was. Uh, <laughs> I, I have no, I don't have no any remember any of the details. I just read it in passing. I was on my way out the door, and I, I caught just you know a quick post of it, and I was like, oh okay, that's either good or bad. <laughs> uh, Tom, later. Have a good one. Uh, oh, oh, Tom's gone. Oh, I got a, I got a split too. Come to think about it, I told Kia Fanky I'd be joining his live show, so I got a split. Hey, that's what's thank up, man. You, man. Thank, thank you for popping in on it, Ninja, uh, Ninja Bill, man. Everybody uh, in the chat, if you aren't already, subscribe to Ninja Bill, man. Thank you for ha having me. Much appreciated. Yeah, no problem, brother. No problem, man. I'm on every weekend, Friday and Saturday night, 10.30 p.m. 10 p.m. till 2 a.m. in the morning is the plan. Awesome. Uh, yeah. um, and chat, everyone in chat, thank you very much for, you know, Joining, joining casual on his live show. Thanks for sitting here listening to me rant about bullshit. Cause you know it's all bullshit in the end. It's just we're talking about toys here. For crying out loud, let's be real. Toys yeah. we love, and if anybody fucks with them, we almost kill them over it. Almost. Not <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to go deal with you. I don't want to. We kill. All right, all right. <laughs> that was nice. Hadn't had him on the show yet. All right, so uh, as always, open invite, man. Anybody want to pop in? Want to shoot the shit with your boy? Talk toys? Look at some stuff here. Taking a, a quick intermission real quick. Making sure that the wires are all wrapped up tightly here so nothing sparks or catches any problems. We'll be cruising at a cruising at an altitude. Cruising at a smooth altitude here. We're going to let JJ Primes take over with the show and show you what he's picked up for the day. How's it going this evening, JJ Primes? <laughs> going good. <laughs> this, this is the hardest working man on YouTube right here. JJ Prime, y'all, live from Malaysia. This <clears> man <throat> is on YouTube off and on all day long, popping reviews in and out of streams. Yeah. Well, I only, I only did two live streams on YouTube, so. Yeah, yeah, no, I'm, I'm just saying you're active, man. You're active. You're out there, and you're a cool guy, man. Yeah, thanks, man. Thanks, Casual Toy Collector. Really, yeah, thank really appreciate you. It. So, what you yeah. what you do today, man? You did you did any reviews today? I saw your uh, your MicroMaster reviews. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, first time I ever shown my face in the review. <laughs> so, yeah, but. I used and, to be nervous about showing my face too, man. But I, I lose the nerve, and, and it's been cool, man. You meet a lot of, you meet a lot of interesting people. That's why. Yep, yep, definitely. So, yeah, this is the uh, the Arc Unicron figure. Yeah. I had. I used to have that one. Yeah. Um, this is actually the the the, uh, the Takara version of the uh, of the figure itself, and um, I'm gonna review it today because you know I want to remember the time that I actually got this, and I want to appreciate the figure because it is a fun figure to mess with. Though I do have some minor flaws here and there with mine because you know minor nitpicks with the figure. Um, it, it's 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 still a good figure to mess with, and I know there's a lot of people going to. Uh, Complain that there's a Decepticon symbol on Unicron. <laughs> Decepticon symbol. There we go. <laughs> but yeah. Um, but you know. And uh, yeah, this is a pretty cool Unicron figure. Um, I never got the planet Unicron, unfortunately. So. Yeah, uh, M3 didn't even know about that. Yeah, they had a tank, a Unicron tank, man. Yeah, Unicron tank. Yes, it, this was actually the original version of the mold was released during Transformer Cybertron. So they had Transformer Cybertron Deluxe Class Unicron. It was labeled as a Decepticon, the first Unicron figure to be labeled as a Decepticon, and then they repainted it to become the Takara uh, Transformers United. Uh, hey, so so what's the story? What's the story on Unicron becoming the same size as the other Transformers? I, well. Basically, it's after uh, 
Energon happened, you know, after Energon, he was killed off, and then, um, I mean, he, did, he wasn't really killed, because we saw his spark still right. kicking. Robots and, uh, never die. Yeah. <laughs> then you remember in Cybertron, um, Unicron actually gave Megatron some new armor, like, using the Unicron armor, and um, then there was a few remnants of Unicron left, uh, of, his, uh, of his sparks or something, I don't know, but I think... You know, uh, Unicron got came back to life. I think it was in the comics of the Unicron trilogy. So, yeah, so Unicron actually came back in the Transformers Cybertron comic, and uh, yeah, he became an, uh, a vehicle now. So yeah. Okay. All right. I didn't know the <clears throat> I didn't know the backstory on it. Yeah. I, I, I mean, I don't really read the comics, but I go to TF Wiki for all the uh, official Transformers news and official uh, Transformers information about what I need to know. And, uh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's quite an old figure, but eh, I don't mind if it's an old figure. I still want to review it because I, I definitely love it. I love this figure. It's very, definitely fun to mess with. And, uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. And it shoot a missile. Pew! <laughs> yeah, I did have a little missile shooting. Yeah. I kind of wish we had um, spring loaded missiles again, so well, it's fine. It's okay. Yeah, they don't do that anymore. It might it might shoot a child and they might get sued or something. <laughs> Everything everything's yeah. off now. Everybody's worried about getting hurt. Mm. Worried about getting sued. <laughs> yeah. Nobody wants to get sued. Yeah, nobody. Sued's no fun. Yeah. No, no. <laughs> no point, bro. That's no point. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean. Oh, I wanted to show. Uh, uh, <clears throat> Roundhead came into the chat. Check out the new Nick Nasty Roundhead. Whoa! Look at that. That's just big, boy. That looks pretty cool. It looks. It feels like. It looks like it's three D printed. Yeah, it is. Oh, okay. That's that's interesting. It's pretty cool. Wow. It's big, man. It's huge. That is that is so huge. It's so big. <laughs> really, really big. But uh, so yeah. Wow. That yeah, and these. Uh, I can't. It's not on the surface, but they roll around. Hey, working treads. Yay. Yeah. We got some working treads. That's awesome. Yeah, that's just cool. That is amazing. I'm doing a black one, too. I've only did, I've only got half of the side done, and I still got to do some painting and stuff to it. But there, yeah. Wow. There's that. I got to do the other one down here, though. Yeah, you got the black version, yes. Uh -huh. That's pretty cool. That's really cool. And I'm getting further with this. Oh, now needs the treads now. Yeah. Yep. I just got to get the treads and I'll be done with that. Nice, nice. That's amazing. <sighs> That's pretty cool. Another big, these shits are big. <laughs> oh no, our David Hill. All right, everybody, I'm going to listen, but I'm trying to finish troubleshooting this electrical short that helped for bet. Oh no. Oh no, I hope so. <laughs> uh, oh no. Uh, he'll be alright. He's an electrician. He can handle it. He's an electrician. He, it's going to be fine. He's going to put yeah. them out. <laughs> I haven't had these uh, blackouts in my house for a long time. No. It's, it's happened in multiple times, but you know, but nowadays we just try to save the electricity. Um, this has come out. Yeah. If I oh, can get the damn thing oh. to stop spinning, it spins like butter. I'm gonna have to tighten that joint. That joint up. This shit spins easily. Our David Hill, you're a construction guy. You're a construction guy for 23 years. Ooh, ooh, nice. I hope I hope Roundhead got to see that. He calls. He says Nick Nasty when when it's something real cool. He says that Nick. Yeah, there we go. That straight. There we go. The straight Nick Nasty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Yeah. Hey, man, Ron here. I got to give you my phone number, man. You need to send me an email, man, so I can so I can send you back my phone number. We can we can text, man. Round, round, we had Ron head on the chat one night, man. Wow. <laughs> That's cool. Use Teflon tape to tighten that spin. I'm, I'm expecting I'm expecting to have these his tanks like really able to go here pretty pretty soon, man. I'm working on working on multiple ones. I'm doing different colors right this second. And I'm gonna sell it like the red one right here is gonna get sold off. I've got somebody lined up for it already though. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> the red yeah. one, finish up the black one. I'm doing I'm gonna do uh I'll, we'll, we'll just well, I'll just we'll just we'll just see we'll just see what all I do. I'm gonna do a lot of different stuff. And I got thrones. I got a throne ready to go to. Uh, trying to figure. I got to look back and see who had dibs on the throne first. And anybody else interested in ordering anything, man, just just holler at me. Hit me up in my email, and and I'll get you my phone number, and we'll we'll communicate about it. Because these these are like customs, you know. It's not. It's not a factory that's making them. It's just one dude printing these shits out. So it's like a custom work, man. And some of the price tags are pretty high, man, because they're going to be. These, you see, these are big ass items. These are big items, and they're they're going to cost a lot of money to ship. And I got to appropriately, I got to make sure they're padded up good, because I don't want you know it, it's three D printed stuff. I don't want that shit to bust up on you. And you can't. You can't be out there ramming these vehicles. If you get two of them, boy, you can't be out there ramming, ramming them together because they're going, <laughs> they'll bust up if you're out there ramming. You can't have real wars with them. These are for display purposes only. It'll roll and shit. It'll roll and it'll work, but you can't be crashing them together. We're grown men now. We got to take care of this shit. <laughs> Hey, smoke screen is prime. Uh, what do you do when your channel? Do you do any Transformers reviews? Do you do anything interesting? He does. Uh, he does. He does collect Transformers, but his his video focus is GI Joe. Vic H, Cobra Night Landing. Okay. I, hey man, I could get you one together this week. Shoot, uh, 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 shoot me an email, and and I'll get I'll get you one uh, done. I can get you one done before the end of the week. I could probably have this shit shipped out by Wednesday, man. Hit me up on my email, and and I'm I get you my PayPal information and and all of that, and we'll. Oh, okay. we'll that. Mr. V Games and Toys. Hello. Hello. I'm not sure if I heard your channel, but let me check you out. Oh, oh, you have 540 subscribers, Mr. V Games and Toy. That's, that's pretty cool. Vic H, uh, what are you talking about, Vic H, on the on the uh, on the his tank? Or are you talking about on the, the boat? Okay, you want you want the boats too. Two Cobra boats. <laughs> On the boat. <laughs> look small or low on the boat. The front gun looks a little too low, VK. Okay. So this is the This is the night landing. Uh oh. Sorry. All right, this is a Cobra Night Landing boat right here. Ooh. It's got the paddles, the paddles up on the side of it here, and then this. The paddles aren't going to be able to be held by by the Joes. I might be able to manipulate something to make the handle fit them, but it's kind of just for display. So the gun, you're a... Uh, I think I think that Vic H is talking about the gun on the front of this. I can I can make the gun come up higher. I can redesign the gun to make it come up higher. I could even make the barrels come out a little bit further on it too, so to stretch out in front of it. Uh, smoke screen is prime. I just gave you a subscription so that we can uh, so, uh, 
I, I just gave you a subscription because um, I, I'll definitely wait for your Transformers uh, videos because I think they will be very, very cool. They're very interesting. Yeah, um, yeah, smoke screen is prime. Um, I'll definitely check out your GI Joes. I'm not really a big fan of GI Joe, but I think it's a really cool franchise, and I think the movies look pretty good. Um, I would love to see a Transformers uh, GI Joe crossover movie of some sorts <laughs> in the future. Yeah. Yeah. I would definitely love to see that. Um, and I would love to see a G.I. Joe X Transformers crossover figure. <laughs> like one of those boats, the tanks, I don't know, but they could do it. It's going to happen. It's going to yeah. happen. Yeah. But yeah, the, the boats, man, the boats are, are highly feasible to do. I could probably pull off a, a, a boat every every two or three days, probably. Oh, what up, uh, Smith? Super awesome reviews, man. How you doing this evening? Hey, uh, links in the chat, Smith. If you're interested, man, you can join in. He's a he's also a reviewer on YouTube. Smith, super awesome reviews. Oh, let me check him out. Let me check him out right now. Yeah. He's got some cool stuff, man. Mr. Mr. Video Games and Toys, he's cool as hell too, man. What up? What up, Mr. Video Games and Toys? All right, all right. He likes Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I love Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles too. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. He has 420 subs. That's amazing. Oh, you have reviewed Masterpiece Sunstreaker. Hey, Miss Smith, super awesome reviews. You know, you know what? Woo, subscribed. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes, Mr. V Games and Toys. Um, I definitely have to check your stuff out, Mr. V Games and Toys. And definitely. Let's see. I do Marvel Legends. That's amazing. And some. Uh, some transformer stuff as well. Turtles. Yeah. Yeah, it looks pretty cool. So yeah. Definitely gonna subscribe to uh, Mr. B Games and Toys because his um, content really looks nice. So yeah. Yeah. Smith super awesome reviews and Mr. B Games and Toys. I just subscribe to your channel because I think you will do great. Yeah, you would definitely do great. You'll, you you guys would definitely uh, hit 1,000 subs. No problem. So, yeah. Yeah, he's he's real cool, man. We had him on the chat uh, three weeks back, I think. Three or four weeks back. Oh, <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't catch that one. Um, oh, there we go. We got him to pop on. Yeah, we get to meet him. Hey, Mr. What up, man? What's up? What's up? <laughs> chilling, bro. You're chilling, bro. Yes, we're chilling. Hey, I've been wondering what you was up to, man. Chilling. Any, any, uh, any toy scores lately, man? You've been laying low. Any Transformers reviews that you're putting up in the future? Goodness. That YouTube grind. <laughs> <laughs> All I yeah. have to do, man. I'm, uh, shit, Mr. V, I tell you, but like, shit, last night did a live show. Uh, got another show coming on Tuesday. Do a wrestling show, do the toy show. Barely got time for my channel. I'm doing like two other channels. So, so <laughs> I keep up with my figures. So you know, I don't, I don't, yeah. don't get lazy with that. So, so you on you on other people? You on other people's shows, right? Like you be showing on other people's shows? There's on your channel. Uh, well, no, actually, the Sanctuary is a group that we, we run on fa uh, Facebook, and we have a YouTube channel where it's basically, it's me and a couple other YouTubers that we get together, and we do a Friday night show called Spaghetti and Friends, and we do toy reviews. Right now, we have, like, our Spaghetti and Friends Invitational Cup, where it's just a mashup of different fighters that we have debates about and have a tournament going on. Right now, we're in the second round of our Kaiju Big Battle. 
So it's all kaijus of just multiple, from different genres. Like last night's fight was Scorponok versus Ultraman. Ooh. Hey, so so what's the name of the channel again? The okay, there's the Sanctuary. 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 The sanctuary. The sanctuary. The sanctuary. Okay, let me check that out. Okay, we because I need to be served to that too, then man. And we do a we, we do a show every Friday night, bro. Nine o'clock. All right, so is it it's like T H E the sanctuary? Like the yeah. And it's not, not I can't fine. find it. Hold on, I'll, I'll, I'll send a link. Give me a minute. Hey, because I want to make sure I subscribe to this. Yeah, because I feel like I stumbled across your shit years ago, man. I I feel like it's a couple of years ago I stumbled across your channel. Uh, man, listen, I'm 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 always floating around on YouTube, but like I said, right now my channel's on a on a rebuild, so I've been kind of focusing a lot of my attention to just uh, spaghetti and friends and and clickbait, which is a wrestling show I do. You do uh, clickbait. <laughs> <laughs> So, yeah, so yeah, I threw it up in a private chat for you. You should be able to hit that link right there. I'm still waiting to see it. I don't know if, it, if my shit is running behind or what. It still ain't popped up, man. So what y'all what y'all got going on over here tonight? Yeah, just chilling, man, sipping some beer. Normal normal weekend chat. Got fifteen people up in this joint. That's what's up. Yeah, hell yeah. It's a good Saturday, man. Hey, shit, ain't nothing wrong with that, man. I, I'm off tomorrow, so I ain't gotta worry about it. Yeah, me too, man. I was I was showing this off, man. The the hiss jet, you seen that? What you Ooh, that's nice. Yeah, with working trails on that shit too, man. Yeah, it's hard. It's hard to hold these chairs. Damn, man. Especially I'm saying, like, <clears throat> if I was in, uh, if I was in the GI Joe right now, I'd be, I'd be hollering at you for some vehicles right about now. This shit, man. Hey, the the GI Joe line though, like you got to buy another house, you got to rent another house type shit to be able to display all this because they so massive, man. For six cents, this shit big, boy. <laughs> That's why I'm out here in the shit. I ain't got room for this shit, man. Mm -hmm. Fuck it, man. B B B B T S. Uh, fuck me. Did me dirty today, man. Oh, what happened, man? I'm, doing, I'm, I'm in the middle of my work day. Now, okay, let's kind of give you backstory. I had some stuff pre-ordered, and you know how BBTS, like, the shit I ordered, everything was supposed to come out at separate, separate different times. Yeah. Right. Back order, back order, back order, come out. Now, every damn figure that I had pre-ordered, all supposed to drop at the same time. Oh, yeah, because Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> But like these are these were figures that should have been out like beginning of the summer type shit. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. And they pushed it back, and just like that, I get a, I get a notification like, "Oh, this just got you just got charged." Yeah, and I'm like, "Charged for what?" <laughs> and then I look, I'm like, "Oh," and it's like, "Wouldn't you know it? It would be the most expensive one. All the cheap ones are still on pre order. Yep. The most expensive one is like, nah, we'll take that now.'" Like you. The fuckers. Hey, I'm like I'm like that too, bro. Like uh, shit, I ordered back in June. They they gonna send me a Storm Shadow. I opened that yesterday on the stream. They done sent me the GI Joe Classified Storm Shadow. I'm like, like I'm looking at my bank statement. And it was like seventy or eighty dollars less than that shit. I was like, man, what the fuck that happened? 
<laughs> what the fuck that happen? Went back looking at looking at Amazon and shit. They're like, oh, it come tomorrow. Like, man, what the fuck? I wasn't planning. I ordered that back in June. Yeah. And then Big Bad Toy Store is going to hit me for Hot House. I was like, damn, I forgot I even got that shit. What? Yeah, they like I said, I they, they, it's on the way, bro. It ain't no stopping that shit. That shit in the mail. I was like, bro, I was like, bro, I was lucky I had some money. I was like, I'm lucky I ain't buy nothing because I was about to go out and do some shit. And I'm like, ooh, I'm lucky I ain't go nowhere. Yeah, for I'd, real, have been, bro. I'd have been fucked up in the game. They like, oh. Pop it up on your ass, like, man, what? And like what, I said, what? it wasn't one of the shit. They picked the most expensive one. The, the, the most expensive one I had on it was $200. No. Oh, you motherfuckers! <laughs> <laughs> All the other ones were like eighty nine dollars. The other, hey. the last, the other one, the most other one was probably like a hundred dollars. That was a pre order, but I'm like, this one was two hundred, and I'm like, you had to pick the most expensive one. Could give me hey. eighty nine. T- could take eighty nine dollars, huh? Hey, boy, I'm low key shitting bricks over here, worried about. Hey, because you know, Kingdom, the Transformers Kingdom shits. They've been, they've been like, you can get them, you can order them. But I, I'd be worried that my pre order is going to kick through, man. It's about, I got three scourges, a hot rod, uh, cyclone. What all the ones that are popping up now, cyclone scourge, hot rod, uh, warpath, core optimus, like all that shit. Boy, if it all hits me right now, I'm dead, man. My, my kids going to kill me for Christmas, man. They're going to be like, man, what the fuck? Why you got all these toys? <laughs> <laughs> So, but hey, listen, lucky, like I said, lucky I didn't do no spending, so I had enough. So I'm like, fucking A though, but I'm sitting, I've been sitting on this motherfucker. This shit should, this shit was supposed to drop in August, my dude. I'm like, come on, bro, you're killing me, BD. But I said, like I said, after all the pre orders I have on there is done, I'm never ever pre ordering with BBT. Yes, again, I'm not. <laughs> no, dead ass, dead ass, I'm not pre ordering with them again. Yeah. I mean, not yeah. just BBTS. I mean, Target and Walmart do uh, kind of. I don't know. Oh yeah, we got Pack in here. Pack hey, Mark. what is that? Pack. Hey, P A K. Hey, good looking out, Pack. Appreciate the sub, bro. Listen, yeah. I, I also it. sub. I also sub, man. Oh shit, they got some man respect. Yo, also, yeah. like, Walgreens is another one. They, they'll, they'll straight up just be like, uh, we had your shit, but we sold it to somebody Let's get, in. Let's get Pack into the stream. Let's get Pack. <laughs> That's right. Let's get Pack in. Hey. Because trust me, they did me like that. They was like, oh, we, we had it, but we, we sold it, though. Talking about that Blue Green? I mean, that Blue Street? Nah, that Moon Knight. Oh, that, man. That Marvel Legends shit. He's like, yeah, we had it. But then we sold it. So you ain't get you ain't never get that. No, no, I, I finally got it, <laughs> but I'm saying like I tried to like okay. I tried to be clever and pre-order it and shit. And he's like, okay, we got you, and then I get a notification like, oh, it's about to come in. They're like, I know we sold it. <laughs> Say what? Sold your pre-order? Right, yeah. Hey, boy, that's shy, Steve. It's all good though. Mm-hmm. I managed, like I said, I managed to get my hand on one, so I was like, I gotta, I can suck a dick, man. <laughs> I ain't fucking with y'all. I got me one. I got me one. I was out looking for GI Joes and bumping into that bitch. I was like, damn, he looked tight as hell. I was like, I feel like I need that for something. So I got that shit. And I just hey, K- uh, KTC, are you gonna review any more Transformers in the future, like the Netflix oh. stuff? Yeah, yeah, I still, well, uh, I'm not sure about how long the reviews are going to be just yet. At some point, it will get back there. Right now, I'm just kind of opening up on live streams. Weekend live streams is my is my, my gas to the channel, I guess, uh, right at the moment. Right, uh, yeah. We have, uh, it's fun, man. It's fun to get on here and just shoot the shit and be yourself and talk toys and, and yeah. mingle with other people, you know? And yeah. no wrong with that. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. That looks There's like no a wrong. that looks like a shock wave over there. What kind of shock yeah, wave? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That? This is the <laughs> this is the uh, studio series leader class. <laughs> Dark to the Moon Shock Wave, yeah. From the Michael Mega movies. A Bay Former. Ooh. Not my cup of tea. But <laughs> I always say I always say to you. <laughs> 
To each their own, you know. Each own. You listen, yeah, to each listen, own. listen. Like, like a wise man once said, if you like it, you win, right? Uh, so I'll, well, I'll, I'll, I, I, it is, listen, it's not in my house. That's all I'm going to say. Not in my home. But I, yeah. it has its place. <laughs> I mean, it's still Transformers. It's still. Like, uh, yeah. I like this. Like this right here. This is nice. See that? Oh, uh, is that? Wait, what? What is that? What company oh, is it? Oh, is it X Transbot? Oh, uh, yes, yeah, X Transbot. Because fucking fans right. toys. Fans toys had me sleeping on a pre-order for him for like a, almost a year. So. Oh, I, I, you just got that? So I popped with the X Transbot. This is pretty good because they 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 going with that cartoon color accuracy now. So it's a good one. It's, it's a good trail breaker. You just got that this week? Uh, no, nah, I've had this for like about a week or two now. Like this one. Hey, he looks big though, man. He looks real big. Like, them shits look real big, man. How do they scale up with the other masterpieces? It's it's masterpiece scale. They made for they're made masterpiece scale to go with official. Okay. So, this is this is filling out my team right now. I'm I'm on the. This is why I'm, my channel's on hold because I'm on the road to G1. So I'm trying to I'm trying to complete season one, two, three, and, and possibly four if I can. Okay. And okay. Like I said, I got some pieces. There's a lot of pieces missing, but I I would say I'm I'm pretty damn close. I'm good. I'm doing pretty good. <laughs> I'm doing pretty especially like for third parties. It's gotta be official masterpiece. So it's mostly masterpiece and third party shit. So I got a lot of fans' toys. And so that's I think I could do it. Uh-huh. While we while we got up on Ruben, what happened? Somebody somebody dying over here? Hey, we're joking. Nobody's heard. We ain't heard or seen Ruben since the night he was in the stream. Though. Oh yeah, that's right. He he yeah, he, he kind of felt some type of way. Yeah man. Oh he, I hope he recovered, bro. And like you know, it's it's, it's fair play. It's not. No, it's oh. no, it's no, it's no, no ill will. Just, I'm just expressing my opinion. Like, like that's how they, I don't, do about the, they don't do the pictures on the milk cartons no more, man. So I don't know what how we go about this. <laughs> oh, he man, he went missing. Like, <laughs> 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 hey, he ain't even hit us. He ain't even hit us with a link to subscribe to his channel or nothing. Like, he came on talking about the stuff, and I wanted to check him out, but I couldn't check him out, man. I love him in the details. Um, I was like, Ruben, you never like know. Man, your man over yeah. here, JJ, he, he's chilling with his shockwave. I mean, I'm pretty sure he can give a fuck if I like it or not. Like, listen, that's, this is this man purchase. That's what he likes. Yeah. Uh, so I can't. Yeah. My, my, I my, my validation to his purchase is, is, is mute. Don't mean yeah. shit. Yeah. Like I said, you you got to like what you like. I don't I don't dictate your, your, your yeah, passion. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's fine, man. It's OK. So, like I said, people get, of- people get butt hurt when I talk bad about Bay Formers. Listen, that's because how I feel about it. Yeah. I'm not going to talk bad about it. No way. I'm not going to, you know, you know, people have their own opinions. They're, they're, they, they can say what they want to say about the Bayverse. I'm not, I'm not offended or anything. So it's all right. Uh, you talking about that, Smith? Which one is that? That's um the net, the Netflix, uh, the, the Netflix yeah. Bumblebee. Bay. Oh, see, yeah. my, they they ain't come around my area yet, man. So I haven't been able to pick it up. But yeah. when they do, I'll definitely grab one. Hey, man, uh, in Georgia uh, too, man. You need to be checking them Walmart's, bro. They bro, brought check, down yo, here. my Walmart is sad as fuck, bro. I checked like three different Walmarts, bro. For real? Sad. For real. Hey, so check it out. Check it out. I got a tip for you. I got a pro tip for you. Um, I can't remember the, I think it's two, five. I, I do. I think I do even remember it. All right. So use brick seat. Did, did your Walmart have any Netflix transformers at all? Or are they all gone? They ain't got no, Netflix. no, 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 no. They got, they got plenty of the, the fucking peg warmers. So there's a lot oh, of chromia and all that shit. Yeah, chromia, fucking red alert. Oh. Sitting there chilling like a motherfucker. You find, you might see a Megatron here and there. They just brought in that. The Netflix uh, Prime that comes with the little Target Masters, they just dropped that bitch. Is that the uh, Netflix one right there, JJ? Is that the Netflix one? Uh, 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 no, no, this is the retail okay. version, the the original First Rise Real Track. So okay, okay, yeah, it's not it's not the Netflix. I I, I wish though, but 
I skipped over the Netflix, man. I don't see a need for it. Nah. Yeah. Nah. Got battle down. The only ones, the only ones I would get are the ones that I don't have in like an Earth fries, but most of the Earth fries I have. I'm just like I said, I'm waiting on that Bumblebee. Like I said, I got a, I got a, I just got the um that two pack Ironhide Prowl. Hello, Dark Conan. Hey, Dark Conan. Yeah, what up, Dark Conan? Dark Conan's watching TFN geeking now. <laughs> <laughs> Two live streams at once. Yeah. Hey, but so if you find a dead Walmart that don't have any Netflix in it, though, Mr. Smith, and you use Brick Seat, use Brick Seat, and you're going to search the SKU number. I think it's 255525. Hold on. 255590999. If you put that SKU in. Mm -hmm. And it shows any Netflix at all. That means that they got a, a restock, and that's the the new gents, man. But you got to find a Walmart that's dead and don't have no Netflix in it to start your search. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what worked for me. My Walmart was dead on Netflix, and and I was my wife went to work, and I was sitting here at the house with the kids, and I searched that that code, and it said that they had a restock on them. I was like, man, I bet these motherfuckers got it, man. Sitting in the back somewhere. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. Like I just found these at uh Walmart. <clears throat> Those REDs. Oh no, the red figures. The, the, the not the non-transforming transformers. They ain't bad. I uh, I mean it's it's yeah. it's the 2020 yeah. version um, of, of a fucking yeah. action master. I, <laughs> Yeah, I appreciate the red figures, but they're Transformers. How, why? How, why? They're, they're action masters now. They're action masters. We've, we've come full circle. Hey, Crimson Raptors is here. We have come full circle. Yo, we have come Crimson right back. Raptor. Yo. We went to G1, we doing Beast Wars. Now we back to action masters. We have come full circle. The, 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 it is time to start over with Neo. Where's the one? Yeah. And then Beast, Beast Wars is coming. Yeah, yeah so, Beast Wars and Kingdom and everything. So. Next thing you know, Wait, we, where, where, where did Casual Toy Collector go? He disappeared. Yeah, I think he might have he might have kind of flopped out. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he'll be <laughs> back. It's his stream. So. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so Crimson good. Raptor! Hey, Crimson Raptor! So, man. so what? What? What do you mostly collect? Like, what's what's what are you what are you hot on? Well, for me, I collect uh, Studio Series. Then um, I got started on Cyberverse Deluxes because they look so so good. What's that right there? Oh, so this is the build a figure Macadam. So. Uh, oh, that's so, that yeah. thing that looks kind of like Few. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of. I don't know, Come but yeah, uh, my McAdam needs a needs a hit right now. He's hitless. Oh, so, uh, yeah, I still need Thunder Howl, man. But anyway, yeah, so Cyberverse. I, I, I haven't really got into Cyberverse, but from what the stuff I've seen, it's like a, it's okay. I mean, I haven't got the into toy it yet. Line, uh, <clears throat> well, here's my take on Cyberverse. The toy line. When I look at the Scout class and the Warrior class figures, I'm like, nah, I'm not gonna spend. I'm not gonna waste my money to buy this. These these things, what are they? I don't know what to. I don't know what I want. To, I, I don't want to, those figures. No, 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 no. Those figures are just. But the deluxes, the deluxes are what drew me to Cyberverse. The Cyberverse toys because the deluxes look really good. They're more fun to mess with, and they're they're poseable. There's no gimmick. They're not hindered by a gimmick. They can, they can bloosh as well. So. Yes. You got any, they got any light piping? Uh, no, not really. I don't think so. Uh, no light piping. Just painted eyes. But uh, I use Photoshop to uh to make the make the eyes glow. So. Oh, what you do? What you do? Stop motion? Uh, I do stop motion uh, transformations for um yeah. Sweet, that's badass, bro. I wish yeah, I could do some shit um, like that, man. <laughs> that was yeah. Then uh, my my channel has literally everything like the TF Toy News and TF Halls, and um, 
sometimes I mean I've started on these uh, on this uh, live streams as well so yeah because my previous one had a uh, Alfonso in so that was amazing um, yeah well, well you gotta sub in me bro so yeah thanks man thanks man I, I really appreciate it um, oh, yeah um, other than cyberverse I do collect the uh, I have I did collect some Transformers Prime stuff and uh, some RID twenty fifteen like for example for Steel Jaw right here. It looks pretty good. Yeah, See, that's what good. threw me off with that with that show was the way they had they depicted the Decepticons. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Weird they, 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 that they were more like yeah. anamorphic robots yeah. than just regular yeah. Cybertronians. Yeah. Yeah, see. Now see, um, <laughs> when I watched R.I.D. 2015, I, I was like enjoying myself watching the show because I thought it was a good show. It had a good plot, good story, and a good follow-up to Transformers Prime because, um, and, um, because, you know, we got returning characters like Bumblebee Returned and Optimus Prime Returned, Soundwave, even Bulkhead and Ratchet and Starscream. Even Laserbeak came in and that was wholesome and uh, some, and a lot of the vehicles as well, but What's weird is that the vehicles were all different colors. Yeah. <laughs> so, and then we got one Insecticon, you know, having Decepticon symbols on the on his shoulder. So, I mean, Transformers Prime, I wasn't too mad at. It, it was decent. It kind of, it kind of definitely gave the G one an updated feel. Um, so wasn't mad at it like that. I, I did get, I get, I did get annoyed how they did the whole. Just like Bumblebee, especially when he's like, oh, I got no voice. Like, cut that shit out, man. It's just, you're too advanced to not be able to fix that quickly. Like, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm just sorry. I just think that's lazy. <laughs> but animated, I think animated was one of those cartoons that it got, it ended too soon. There was so much more you could do with that. Just that style was different and it was. It was good. It, it, it kind of picked up at the end. And it really did. And then when they started introducing new characters, it's like, yeah, now this is like open up that fucking door. Yeah, yeah. 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 Show canceled. Ah, uh, thank you. Just sitting there giving you that good jerk. And it's like, you're about to come in. They're like, no, I'm done now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Finish. I'm just sitting there um, with the balls. It's, yeah. it's the worst. Yeah. Well, it's, it's okay. But, and uh, yeah. And, other than those toy lines, I did collect the Prime Wars trilogy stuff, but not, 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 not everything. Combiner Wars, um, I was only excited for the first three waves, but Wave Four on Birds was just no, 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 no. The Bruticus wave like kind of let me down for like, I don't know. Brawl was a new mold, but if you look at his robot on his belly, which is uh, he's brown. Since when Brawl is brown? He's green. Listen, Combiner, Combiner Wars was a mixed bag. Yeah. I think the, the best thing to come out of there was Devastator. Yes, I have to agree with you, man. Which, um, by the way, they're reissuing as a Hasbro Pulse exclusive now. Yeah, yeah. So. And, uh, then there was a Titans Return. Um, they had good figures. you know. Titans Except Return for Galvatron. Figures. That Galvatron is shit. Okay, let's be real. Galvatron, you look at the jet mode, I'm like... Guess everything, nah. about, everything about Galvatron is wrong. It is just... It is so much wrong that it could have been right if they, you know... Like, the cannon's overly big. Like, it's just ridiculously big. <clears throat> the whole head... The whole face shield is just dumb. Yeah, it's like, it's like he's wearing a Halloween mask. Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> other than that, like the body wasn't bad. Like there was, it, it was definitely signs of potential. Good. Yeah, that was good in the figure, but being a triple changer was just no. Kept no. leave him as a cannon, leave him as a robot, and and, and, and and like I said, make the arm cannon a little bit smaller, and he should have had a better head sculpt. Like if he was gonna make him a headmaster, make it do it proper. But he should have never been one in the first fucking place. So let's be real. Yeah. yeah. So, but um, after seeing that uh, little trailer for the next season on Netflix, I'm like, ooh, does this mean we get in a new Galvatron? Yeah, well, ooh. well, we are getting a new Kingdom Leader class Galvatron. Yes. So, 
It's leader class. So I'm like, oof. I'm, I'm, excited. Like, I, I'm excited. Like just seeing that little part, that's like it didn't even like, yeah, I'm excited to see what he's going to be in the cartoon. But like, I just remember balls tingle a little like, ooh, this means we got to be getting a figure soon. Yeah. Got to be getting a figure. Yeah. Just, just don't fuck it up, though. Don't fuck it up. Don't, don't be, <laughs> like, seriously, don't be extra. Don't try to be extra with him. One, <laughs> one mode. That's it. Don't be extra. If he's got, I don't care if he's got to be a, if he's got to be a tank or something. I don't give a fuck. But just keep them simple. Don't be extra. Yeah, that's why I uh, passed on the figure because I didn't think it was good. The cannon mode is gorgeous. I would say the cannon mode is good. Robot mode. Nah. Nah, the robot mode is nah. I, I'm not that crazy about the Earthrise version of Megatron, to be honest with you. Oh, that's fine. You know, people have their different opinions on Earthrise Megatron. I think it's a good figure um, because a lot of the has been remolded from the original Siege figure, and I think they tried their best to uh, to give us a more uh, G1 accurate Megatron or Earthrise. I mean, you know, according to the robot mode, actually. So. Because I think the robot mode for Earthrise Megatron, the chest definitely looks more G1 accurate, and then the robot, the, the head is also... Yeah, that's what, that's, that's, what, that's what throws it off for me. I think the head's a little... It, it feels more comic booky than cartoon -y. You know what I'm saying? If, yeah. Does that make, yeah. that make sense? Mm -hmm. I don't know if you if you ever saw the old Marvel yeah. comics of how Megatron looked. It's like, mm. but yeah. I mean, even all I'm still cool with it. I, I if I see it, I'll probably pick it up. So why the fuck not? I got every other little piece from Earthrise. Why why stop now, right? <laughs> yeah, but if you saw the uh, the Kingdom Core class Megatron, I think that one looks pretty good. Yeah. It's so much better than the uh, the Voyager one. I like the one they did in the G two colors. Oh yeah, the, the generation Trump. selects. Uh, yeah. yeah. Um, the new Studio Series figures, Big H. Um, yeah, I definitely love uh, Studio Series Dino. Uh, that's my most anticipated deluxe. Um, then. Uh, the Bumblebee movie Star Screen, Bumblebee movie B127, aka Bumblebee himself. That 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 definitely looks gorgeous. I'm I'm definitely gonna pick that one up. And um what other studio series? Ah, the studio series 86 figures. Oh man, hot rod, scourge, cup, all of, rot, them. all of them, all Blur, of them, jazz, all of them, man, all of them. All of them. I just hope they aren't too close to Earthrise slash Kingdom figure. Ah! Did you see? They, did you see they're doing a, a Bumblebee and the Stars? I think um, what the Star Scream them Reds. They're doing a Star Scream one with a coronation and a Bumblebee one too as well. So yeah, um, I uh, definitely yeah. A uh, Studio Series, uh, really really great toy line. Um, they finally gave me a uh, proper screen accurate Shockwave. Although he didn't transform in the, in the show, but hey, it is what it is. You know, they can create alt modes really crazy, and you know, it's it's engineering. They can engineer the figure really, really well. Um, but the only figure from the leader class lineup that I really want to have is definitely the Fallen, because that design looks pretty, pretty sick. <laughs> looks uh, pretty good, and um, I definitely need that. The Fallen. I don't even have the Fallen from Revenge of the Fallen. Don't even have it. So, I mean, I do have R.A.D. Megatronus because you know Megatronus is the Fallen, but it's not the same. <laughs> it's not the same design. Nothing yeah, the I, same never got, I never got. I never got to the Studio Series. The only ones I'm looking forward to is the '86. Those drop mm -hmm. them. Definitely gotta pick that up. Yeah. I was I was hoping they was gonna do a, a Studio Series Galvatron like. The time to really step it up and give you some real hot well, shit. Well, the I mean, there, there are listings for a Kingdom Leader class Galvatron, so I hope that one is really screen accurate to its 1986 appearance. That'd be so, nice. Yeah, and then Cyclonus was in the Kingdom line, you know, in the first wave of Kingdom. And I know it should be in the Studio Series line, but it's okay. And and um, yeah. Like, oh, right. is, yeah. Here's a question. Um, 
the kingdom. Where, where, where do we go next with Transformers after Kingdom? That's a good question. Um, well, we we have some live action movies coming out, like the animated Cybertron prequel and um, live action Beast Wars and the, the Bumblebee sequel. So we only got three films confirmed to come out soon. Hey, yeah, I'm you, no key three five five nine. I know you. But you still gotta have mainline though. You still gotta have like mainline G one. You could do the movie stuff, but you need some kind of harken to G1. So what do you do next? Like who, who, what other characters that haven't been made? Cause like I said, we have a Scorponok. We got a kick-ass oh, no. Sky. We got a kick-ass Skylinks. Beast, beast, beast Machines. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to see Beast Machines. <laughs> I mean, I, I think I would love to see Beast Machines again because I was watching the uh, some of the episodes yesterday and the dialogue was pretty, pretty great. You know, the dialogue was pretty great. The designs, however, I don't know. Yeah, the transformations yeah. are not practical. We can't. We can't <laughs> yeah. go backwards. Once we've we, we, we've come all the way to Earth Rising Kingdom, we can't go back. Like we can't go back yeah. to the days of Combiner Wars. Like we've we've come too far. Maybe they could, you know, make a new uh, Combiner gimmick or something. You know. I was saying they need to they need to tap into more of the the Japanese stuff. If you really, they're like, hey, when, when are we gonna get a Star Saber? Anyone get target thrust yet? Big H uh, says that. Um, well, I already ordered him, so he's coming on the way, and uh, there will be a review um, after 25th of December. So, so I'm definitely excited to open him up and uh, review it. And uh, I'm still I'm trying to I'm find still roundabout. On the hunt, and, so. Yeah, I'm trying to find roundabout two and, and neat three two packs. Yeah, uh, actually, you know what? <coughs> The Autobot clones uh, from the Earthrise two pack. The Autobot clones, I I really want them, but I'll probably get you know probably get. Uh, I just I got know. those for my birthday not too long ago. The the clones. Oh, okay, cool, cool, nice. I wish I had them, but I do have the the Supercon clones. At least I do have those. So yeah, but yeah, um, I got thrust. Coming in the way, and uh, yeah. oh, those are some the kind of clones you got. Um, I have the oh man, I, I, I definitely still want those oddball clones, man. I still want them actually. Why can't I just order them now? <laughs> and then I got this right here. What was it? Oh, you have the. The ultimate universe Optimus Prime. Yeah. Oh, That's crazy. Yeah, man. That's super crazy. But yeah. Um. You know how it, you know how it be with Woo! Oh, welcome back. Hey, hey welcome Real. back, Andrew Toy Collector. Welcome back, boy. Jesus. What happened there, man? A hard drive died on me. Dang. Oh no! Yeah. Oh no! <laughs> Man, I, I heard the shit the whole the whole time I'm sitting here. I hear it clicking. It's a backup drive, a secondary hard drive on the computer, and I hear it clicking. But I I paid it no mind. Everything was running fine, and the computer just went blue screen. I was like, oh shit! So the stream's dead. And I look back at my phone. It's still going. I was like, man, that's cool. Hey, yeah, that shit's cool, man. I was like, y'all, I was like, okay, y'all, y'all hang in there, hang in there. I'm coming, I'm coming. <laughs> yeah. Shit, yeah, I know, man. It's that's, that's pretty cool, though. I do enough of these yeah, to, just, to be just keep reference. <laughs> yeah, shit happens, boy. Shit happens. Yeah. That's the truth. Um, I've, been, I've been kicked out of my own stream a few times, and I had to, like, <laughs> I'm like, oh, my shit froze, and everybody's like, they just keep going. Nah, I'm like, I, I get back in. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, so I did over here. Did you say SS Fallen? Um, well, it's not confirmed yet, but I still think that Studio Series could release the Fallen. Yeah, they could do it and make a Cybertronian jet mode for him. So, now I might. Because I I've still got the fallen toy, the other one or whatever. <laughs> I might would fuck with that one, maybe. 
there's oh. there's a few there's a few bay formers that I that I fuck with here oh. and there, man. Oh. Okay, Spooks Queen is Prime. Um, all right, we'll, we'll catch you, man. Hey, yeah, yeah we'll man. catch you later, Smoke Screeners, man. Thanks for thanks for tuning in, man. And, and subscribe to my channel as well, man. Yeah, I got good stuff coming in. Yeah, he, he was on he was on the stream yesterday. I think he did subscribe to you. He was on the, he was on it yesterday. Did he? I, I, I don't remember. But. Yeah, oh, cool. oh, okay. Now, now I got two additional subscribers. <laughs> there you go. There you there go. Four, four, four. <laughs> Yo, whoever, whoever designed this DeLorean Transformer and the, that little oh. thing on the back doesn't stick on, like, yo, y'all some bullshit. No, you're going to lose that shit, boy. It's going to be in the vacuum cleaner. Bro, that shit already <laughs> fell under my desk right now. I haven't even gotten down to get it. I was like, fuck it. You'll stay there for a hot minute. <laughs> and you're going to forget it? You're going to forget it? You're going to be vacuuming it more? You're going to hear it click, click, click? And you're going to be like, what the fuck is that? Uh, <laughs> it's whatever, bro. But it, you know, it, it is nice. I ain't, ain't going to lie. The, the, the DeLorean oh, shit is nice. It was yeah. cool, man, that they did that. They did that. It's cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ectotron, Gigawatt. Yeah. Uh, they should have made, uh, made Ectotron a combiner, though. It should have kept the combiner stuff. Mm, yeah. yeah I, do have, I do have Ectotron, too. So I was trying to see if I could find that uh, the Top Gun, uh, the Maverick. They could have they could have milked it though. They could they could have made each of the vehicles like Egon and and you know, Ooh, nah, and then it could have been a giant combiner. Hey, thanks, man, Mr. V Games and Toys. Really appreciate the support. I'm really getting there. Five hundred. Oh, uh, un yeah. unknown unknown Loki three five five nine. Welcome to the chat. Thank you, man. Yeah, yeah, uh, he subscribed to me, I think. Yeah. Okay. I think so. Yeah. They should do uh, they should have the, the oh. Gigawatt, Ectotron, Take Maverick, and then like you would need two more. I would say they need to make fucking Kit from Knight Rider. Yep. Yep. Oh yeah. And I think so. I, I mean, would say the X Men one, right? They got the X Men one, but that is too big for a combiner. But I would say. I would say the general lead, but that's too controversial for some folks. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. But it's still a sweet fucking car. Like, come on, man. If you're that, if you're that butthurt about it, we'll, we'll keep the flag off just for you sensitive motherfuckers. Yeah. But, uh, repro labels. Repro labels can hit. <laughs> yes, you feel me? Because, <laughs> yo, know, I'll be it's dead ass. If they, made, if they made one without it, I would get a repro label. Okay. <laughs> The, the only is. the only cross I, I figure. Fan, listen, I was a child and I watched the Dukes of Hazard, and I didn't look at the car as some symbol. I just looked at it as a badass motherfucking car. It yeah, sweet jumps and Davey yeah. Dukes, and Bo and Luke and Uncle Jesse and running from the police. Yeah, yeah running, running from, 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 from the Roscoe and Boss Hall. Yeah, yeah and y'all motherfuckers got the shit all twisted. You know, feel me. Yeah. So bring bring back bring back the classic general Lee. Stop stop <laughs> um, act, like, act like that it wasn't a part of your childhood. Shame on you. Yeah, for real. <laughs> act like I was the only black motherfucker that had a little General Lee car in his house and I watched Deuce of Hazard and I jumped that motherfucker off off off, off a transformer. Stop playing. Mm, hey, put a twist on that shit, man. Get a general Lee and put dunk, dunk that bitch out, boy. Put it on little kids with 30 inch rounds on that shit. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, so yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Well, let's, let's take out the general lead. What would be the next one if they can make a transformer out of it? Let's see. I went by the 18 fan. Oh, fuck yeah. Iron Hide. They can turn Iron Hide into the 18 van. I'll be all over that shit, boy. I'd buy three of them. One to keep the cars, one for the truck mode, and one for the robot mode. I still want another uh, another gigawatt, man, just for the to have both of them, you know. Uh, I'm looking for another one too. Right. Yeah. In fact, if I find another um, one, I'm keeping that shit in the box. So. <laughs> what other iconic vehicle? Uh, uh the thing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles vehicle. Uh, licensing, no, but yeah, yeah I, I think it's gonna be hard, but that'd be cool. 
It will be nice. Um, like I said, General Lee is good. Uh, definitely, like I said, I don't know how we're not going to see a kid soon. Got to have a kid. Like, that's like, why haven't you done it? That should have been the first fucking one you did, to be honest. Yeah, yeah. Before Gigawatt, even. Yeah. Um, <laughs> the 18 van would be up. Yeah, 18 uh, van. Ooh, Maybe a Batmobile. Say, oh yes, we need the Batmobile as a transformer. Yeah, yeah. No Batmobile would be good. Which one? We talking Adam West Batmobile? Ooh, that's a lot of Batmobiles. Uh, sure. Either the original one, the Christian Bale version, or the uh, the Batman v Superman version. I don't know. Uh, I want for personal for personal reasons only. Can I get a Blues Brothers cop car <laughs> transformer? The Blues Brothers Transformers. Yes, yes real, <laughs> real old heads will know what that, what that, what I'm talking about. So, <laughs> you've seen the original Star, Blues, Star the Blues King Brothers. You know. Oh. Yeah. 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 You got me trying to think about cars, like iconic cars, man. Mm-hmm. Fucking. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, Starsky oh, Starsky and Hutch. Oh, the Grand, right now. Yes, the Grand Torino. Yes, Starsky and Hutch. That's a good car, too, bro. That'll be a nice transformer. Mm -hmm. Grand Torino. Mm -hmm. the, the dog van from Dumb and Dumb. <laughs> oh, that's, that's funny. <laughs> I'd get three of that too. Right back. I'd get three of the dumb and dumber shit too. <laughs> Ooh, how about a uh, Mach Five? The Spaceballs. Uh, David Hill was in here. The Spaceballs minivan. How that been turned into a transformer? The Winnebago. <laughs> yeah. No, wait, no, 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 no. Spaceballs. The the the, the maid in the Spaceballs. They should do that. Yeah, the Rose. Oh, Mega, Rose Mega, Mega Maid. Mega Maid. Mega yeah, Mega Maid. Mega Maid, yeah. <laughs> Mega Maid. <laughs> hey! Pop, I swear to God, Pop, I was just finna say this shit. Airwolf. I started thinking military vehicles. I was like, motherfucking Airwolf. I swear I was just finna say that shit, Pop. Airwolf will be mad. That's a nice little helicopter right yep, there. Yep. A black helicopter. That shit. That shit. Mm -hmm. Typically would be Decepticon, but I guess it'd be an Autobot because it's on the good guys' side. I would say well, Decepticon. Oh, God. Yeah, that shit's black. Hey, yeah, it, Air it, it black almost even sounds like, like a Decepticon, man. Yeah, it does. It does. Ooh, here's, a, here's a little cut. On the, on the, what about Thunder in Paradise? What's that? that? Whole, that's the Hulk Hogan show we had that Hulk fucking speedboat. Have the boat turn into a robot? That'd be tight. That'd be tight. Come on, hey, bro. but if Hasbro comes out with any of this shit, man, we suing them. Uh, Chips yeah. motorcycle. <laughs> that's a, that's a fight, too. fight too. Yeah, yeah. They but could you, use uh. Just, just pay me my royalties, bro. bro. Pay me my. <laughs> they could use a, the groove from Combiner Wars. They could use that shit for the Chips motorcycle. <laughs> <laughs> hey. A G.I. Joe crossover? I already got one in idea. The Vamp G, and it turns into home. Actually, there's a third one already doing that already. For real? There's, they got one that got his tank. That's supposed to transform into like Soundwave. Well, I'm talking about the, my, my specific idea was have the Vamp G turn into to home. The green G. This shit. Uh, have this turn into hound, and I I want to start cutting this up and trying to figure out how to how to make that happen myself. That'd be tight, bro. Yeah, yeah. And I don't believe it'd be that difficult, man. Just kind of, you know, kind of like it's gonna be boxy as fuck. I'm not, you know, just gotta figure out the engineering, bro. Yeah, yeah. It'll be boxy starting off, but I'm sure I can improve things, get a little bit better. Transformers don't do too many motorcycles. Ah. 
Uh, I no, mean, they have the they have the junkions. But yeah, junkions they, are good. They, but the junkions need to be in the Studio Series eighty six line. They got to be. I can't wait. I can't wait. Hey, and I hope, I hope that they do two or three different faces, man. I hope oh, that yes. that'd be nice. Yeah, I hope there's some options. And if, if they don't do it, I hope somebody makes some extra heads to put on them or something, man. There's yeah. A little, you know, a little variance to them, man. Like they gave us a set with uh, who was it? Hot Rod, I think it was Hot Rod and two Junkions or some some shit in the Generations line. Yeah, yeah. And it was two and Junkions and a Hot Rod. Were different. They were a little bit different in their design. Mm-hmm. If they do that mm-hmm. shit again, that'd be perfect, man. But all I need is a Red Gar. A rat guard, and then at least two, at least two other dudes, at least yeah, two. Yeah, junk, junkie and, and, um, and another one. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> and all, man, all they gotta do is switch around and then they still put up the recast. Mm-hmm. So. KFC did do some junkie on. I got, I got, I got the red car and a second junkie on. I didn't pick up one of those new ones yet, but I might. Cause they did. They are pretty sweet. <laughs> I'm I'm sure we're gonna get man. They're gonna do all that shit for the '86 line. They're gonna have. Uh, mm-hmm. I bet you. Uh, uh, I bet you they come out with a repack of Jazz. <clears throat> One of my predictions: they're gonna do Jazz and 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 uh, Spike in in the the exo suit. They're gonna have a moon base set, and it'll be an Amazon exclusive. <laughs> well, probably a Hasla, a Hasbro, yeah, Hasbro yeah. Pulse. Or Target. It's going to be Target. And we're all going to be pissed off. Listen, <laughs> you're fucking always going on exclusive hunt, man. <laughs> Target, hey, Target don't make no sense. I've gave them so many reviews. Why, why do we pre-order shit, man? We got to wait three, We got to wait three weeks after everybody else gets it in the store. What, what, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, this oh, definitely yeah. the year. This definitely the year of exclusive. in Target. That's just like, man. Yeah. That's definitely know. the. Uh... Wait, what was Bruce Wayne's father's name? Uh, Thomas Wayne. That name. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's just tight as hell. My buddy Bruce is into Batman heavy. He loves that Batman shit. I ain't gonna lie. Like I said, I I, I dig what he's doing because I, I I have expectations of like okay, once he's done getting that nut off, he get, he's gonna have to do the rest of DC afterwards. Once he gets that Batman out of his system, it's like yeah. ah, right, you gotta pick you gotta pick someone else now to play with. <laughs> Me and my boy, we used to Jones about that movie all the time, though, because he was talking about Batman or fuck Superman. Up. I'm like, man, come on, this God versus man. Yeah. It's like, man, bro. It's like, I know you like Batman. Yeah, man. Like he just he just showed off. They got a he got the Batman Beyond coming out soon. Yeah. Yeah. What's yeah, I really um I really don't like the. Uh, Exclusives for the Transformers toys, um, like uh, Runabout is a Target exclusive. It's kind of very, very hard to find in my country because I don't, I don't got any Targets in my country. And um, oh yeah, where you from, bro? Yeah. He's in Malaysia. I'm all the way in Malaysia. <laughs> Shout out to my Malaysian people, son. Yeah, they talk about Yeah. Yeah, I'm in Malaysia and um, I'm, I'm still doing my uh, my reviews and I'm still working on them and um, yeah and and I decided to bring on my face during my reviews as well so yeah during the Mac Masters so yeah uh, that's that's unfortunate VK you canceled so many target orders but you managed to find the fi- you managed to find the figures in store that's that's great yeah that's amazing. See, that's I'll be feeling bad for cats who live like, like I, got, I got people that live in Canada and shit like that. That can't. It sucks when you can't. Like shit like this for us is kind of easy. We take it for granted. It's like, like oh, then not everybody got a one for you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> Vkh. Um, so. I don't. I, I I'm not. I don't know how to do uh, shipping. You know, I I can't really do giveaways just yet. Um, maybe when I'm older. When I'm uh, in my 
30s. I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. <laughs> I get older. How, how are you? Are you 12 or something? I'm 19. I am 19 years old. Yeah, I'm 19. Oh, man. Must be nice. <laughs> Must be nice. <laughs> Must be nice. Oh, I've, been collecting, I've been collecting since I was eight. So. Hey, listen. Yeah. Respect, man. Must be nice. Yo, listen. I'm. Yeah. Enjoy it. Yeah, enjoy my collection. Enjoy it. And I also uh, enjoy my reviews. I'm, I'm still going no, to No, I'm about enjoy 19. Don't, don't rush to, to get old, bro. Enjoy yeah. that shit. Real talk. talk Life is short, man. Life goes quick, boy. Life goes quick. It goes that? quick. You're talking, you're, talking, you're talking to a 41-year-old man right now. Yeah. Enjoy that shit, bro. And 42. <laughs> I'm 42. Enjoy that shit. <laughs> that shit but, gets yeah, complicated, uh, boy. It gets complicated. <laughs> we just enjoy ourselves and um, enjoy so doing, uh, doing our reviews. And uh, yeah, I'm still gonna do reviewing uh, some old figures in my collection because you know what? I want I want a nostalgia coming out of my channel, and uh, you know I just want to remember my old figures. I want to give them my support and appreciate my old figures. I want to review them. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, after 25 yeah. is over, after 35 is downhill. <laughs> <laughs> Shit starts breaking down. You you don't you don't move as quick. You don't heal as fast as you. Like back in the days, you just kind of like Wolverine. Now, mm. You take a bump on Mondays, you got a bump on Friday. And you're like, where did it came from? When did I get cut? <laughs> Why am I bleeding? Like sometimes I'll be like, I'm bleeding. Like I don't even know when I got cut. <laughs> Your body don't heal, listen. And you numb to it. You done got hurt so many times before. You don't feel getting cut and shit and over like that. Yeah. No, Trust me, them, them, them bumps, them bumps. Mm, no. <laughs> nah, man. Yeah, man. Enjoy life, boy. Enjoy life, man. Mm -hmm. Trust me, I'm gonna tell you yeah. right now. Don't even if you in good shape, your body will betray you. <laughs> it will betray you. It's gonna, yeah. So. It's gonna turn on you. Like the things you, the things you take oh, for granted now. Yeah. You gonna be like, you oh damn. Oh. Like, you, you gonna look at milk differently. <laughs> said milk. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta make sure you check what time it is before you eat any tomato-based foods. Yeah. <laughs> Art burn and shit. Yeah. Real talk, bro. Real talk. Because it didn't happen when I was nineteen. It didn't happen. So you was like, oh, three in the morning. Let's eat some spaghetti. Let's rock. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, think about that shit now. Because <laughs> you might wake up at like five in the morning. <laughs> yeah. You fucked up. Eat, eating that meat lover's pizza that's been sitting around all afternoon, just mm -hmm. grabbing it. 19, yeah, you go hard body. You go hard body. Yep, 19 years old, yes. Bru brush that shit <laughs> off like your name was Logan. <laughs> you get to 40, you old man Logan. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the old, man Logan. old man Logan. You're gonna heal, old but not so man. fast that you still gonna feel some you will still feel some of it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Like yes, I played football in high school and I was not I was yeah. clanging and banging. Yeah. And you pop up like fucking hawk. You guys think we're gonna get a vendor retro figure? Oh, Oh, that retro Venom. Oh, we already got Venom from the movie, so we sure. already got that figure. Um, sure. Sure, I would love to see a Venom retro figure if, if that happens. Oh, you already know they're going to yeah. repaint that movie figure into a uh, retro Venom. Come on now. Give it give it, give it, a couple months. Yeah. That's going to get a repaint. Yeah. <laughs> they're yeah. going to make it. They're going to make it because you want it, Vic H. They're going to yeah. make it because you want it. Believe mm -hmm. that shit. You saw what they did with that monster venom, the build the figure one. What did we get after that? You got a you got a classic Ooh. painted venom from that. Ooh. So you don't think they ain't gonna milk that fucking mold and give you a classic painted venom from that movie mold? Oh hell yeah. 
Hey, every everything I could think of, everything I could think of that I would want, like throughout the years, any any little creative idea that's come up in my head, somebody it's either been done or somebody's doing it, or you know what I'm saying. Like mm-hmm. anything is possible, man. If if you dream it, if you if you think of that shit, Vic H, it's gonna happen, man. Somebody's gonna do that shit. Yeah, definitely. And you know what, Vic H. If they take too damn long doing it, you do it your damn self. Make it yourself if they take too long. Shit, if I had that kind of skill, I'd be repainting a whole bunch of figures. <laughs> yeah, I'm scared of paint. I'm kind of scared of paint, but I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get. I got to get with it, man. To really, really fine tune this shit and make it look real tight, I got to get with it. Because uh, I hear like the best is you gotta pick up that air, that airbrushing. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> oh lord, you gonna get me started on a whole nother <laughs> shit I gotta buy now, man. I done bought casting shit and I got five printers and like Jesus. The hole just gets deeper and deeper and deeper and deeper, man. You start out collecting toys and then you then you wanna make toys and shit. Uh input. Input, input. Hey. input. I didn't even know he was off in the gym, man. Yeah, he does. He does customs too, man. Inputs a really fucking cool dude, man. Oh, for real, really cool dude. Yeah, yeah. I would love to get him on the show, man. Let's try to get it. Try to get input. Yes, get input. Input. Join in the chat. <laughs> hey, Ninja Bell's back. <laughs> I think we might have got input in just for a short skit on one of the chats one time. I think he might have he might have popped in for a second and something might have he might have got disconnected or I can't remember what was going on. I, I don't think he was in the show. I don't think he was in the stream now. No, I, hey. I feel like I've had he just popped in like in one of the live streams I've done. It may even it be a month, it might even be a month and a half back uh, or something. But I feel like he popped in for a short skit. Or I might have oh, been. Oh, you do input the stop motion. Oh, you absurd. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Subscribe, yeah, bro. Subscribe. Yeah. I love stop motion. Oh, I see. So, bro. Yeah. Mhm. Yeah, Mr. Video Game Toys said he ain't forgot about Unicron. Okay. Yeah, Ninja Bill's back. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it might have been on Pax channel that that we crossed paths or something. I, I swear, I feel like either that or I'm thinking of, of the future, man. Maybe we got a stream coming up in the future we don't know about yet. Input. <laughs> yeah. We, we all seem to cross paths. Uh, all the toy collectors, we all seem to cross paths. The one, the ones that are bold enough to get on YouTube, we all seem to cross paths eventually. <laughs> Listen, man, we all under the same umbrella, bro. Yep. All under the same umbrella. We all fucking love toys, and we want people to hear our opinions on toys, so so they know what else to make more of. Yeah. Oh, he's talking about. Uh, I know what you're talking about, uh, Mister Video Games and Toys. You're talking about the Unicron, like my buddy had in his room, the the one that hangs up like the display, the display shit. I know what you're talking about. <laughs> but yeah, as a community, that's what it's all about, man. We just want our voices heard, so so yeah, the shit yeah. that we want gets made, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah it's the yeah. Transformers community, and we want to, uh, you know, support each other. You know, be, be good to each other and be kind. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Even though there'd be some people out there that act like they did, they too good. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> to talk, talk to motherfuckers, but that's yeah. okay. So I tell them, listen, I, I remember that. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. I don't need you. <laughs> Fuck it. I don't need it. Whatever. Yeah. And this one is not I'm going to do me. I'm going to do me. Ninja Bill says, I was over on TFN Geeks channel for a bit about the crash, but wanted to stop back and buy casual. JJ and Mr. Smith, what's up? Hey, what's up, Ninja Bill? I'm doing good. Um, yeah, it's um, getting late, Bill. It's getting late, Bill. I can dig it, man. Yeah, I'm planning to uh, review this guy. So, 
yeah, there's going to be a lot of positives for this guy, but um, I don't know. <laughs> because this figure is actually pretty good, even though he's an old one. So. Yeah, J JJ Prime is 19 years old and he doesn't sleep. He hasn't. He 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 grow, He's on a 24-hour YouTube grind. You catch him on the next live stream when I crash because I'm I'm not 19. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he's not been on two live streams today, boy. JJ Prime gets around, man. You're a busy dude, man. You're a busy dude, man. I respect that. Um, yeah, I'm a busy dude. Um, you know, I'm still in. You know, have education. Yeah. Yeah, man. Yeah. yeah. Oh wait, I'm not Loki. Uh, he says, "How likely would it be for Hasbro to make Studio Series break away?" I know he was concept art, but so was Scrap Metal Overload. <coughs> this says breakaway. I'm trying to think who a breakaway is. He's from the game, I think. He's from the video game. Is it a car? He was a jet, I believe. Breakaway, breakaway, breakaway. Okay, I can't put a. What up, Jay? Jay, holla. Uh. Revenge the Fallen. Yeah, the video game. Uh, when it comes to stuff like that, I would say it, it depends if, if Hasbro stick to the market for that character. If he was, if he sought out, then they would. If he's not, they probably pass. Him. They're not gonna waste the plastic on something that's not gonna sell. Yeah. Hey, what's up, Jay Holla? What's up, Jay? I don't think Holla? they're gonna do it, man. I don't think they do it. it. It doesn't seem like enough interest in that that character. It seems too. Uh, it seems too abstract, really, to to come to come and have. It ain't gonna come about. <laughs> The only way something like that would get made is if they did everybody else. He would be the bottom of the barrel. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's kind of like what we got with Earthrise. Like we're getting so much that they're making new shit because they've already scratched the bottom of that barrel. Like we we were back. Oh, to the right. So I'm just I'm just putting a, I'm putting a, okay. So he's he's a brown jet. Yeah, like he's brown. Brown or some he's brown shit. Yeah, he's brown. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. It's all coming back to me now. Ah, uh, uh, well, I don't know, man, because they did make one toy for it already. They uh, did a thrust toy. Remember? It was uh because I had the thrust. The thrust wasn't that bad, actually. I think I still got it uh, from the Michael Bay line. Thrust. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Breakaway, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. thrust it was break. Uh, breakaway was a repaint of thrust. Ninja Bill pointed pointed it out. Yeah, now I see it. Yeah. yeah, I'm not sure if they would do an SS of that one though. I, I don't. Know, I don't believe so though. At least in my head, I don't know. He's a cool looking figure though. I mean, I know uh, the studio series were about the movies, but um, I mean, the games were related to the movies, so. I never get to do the game character from Warpath, you know, because I would love to see a studio series Warpath from the video game Dark of the Moon. So there was a uh, there was a Warpath that came out from from the Michael Bay shit too, I believe. Yeah, that, yeah, yeah I, that, that's what I'm about, yeah. I still got yeah. that man. I got a bunch of Bay formers. I need to sell all that shit off though. I ain't got room for it. Like, mm -hmm. they're cool. The ones that I got, they're cool, but I can't, I ain't got room for it, man. <laughs> Mr. Smith, don't do it. Boy. He's just like, eh, eh. <laughs> can't do he, get that squeam, he get that squeam, boy, every time he hears my. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even going to say nothing because I, I, you know me already. I, I, I get all. <laughs> I know what you're talking about too, though, man. Hey, some of them be a hot fucking mess, man. Yeah, you wouldn't even think it's a car. You wouldn't think it turned into a car at all. It's like, what the fuck is the point, man? Like, some of them be weird looking, man. And it's, and it's so simple. Yeah. Like you, you don't have to overthink it. That's the problem. Like, don't get me wrong. There are certain ones, like like the Shockwave one. I'll give Shockwave the credit because 
he doesn't really take an earth form. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can kind of get away with all that. So it works. Yeah. Even in Megatron to a degree, but when they try to give him an, uh, an earth form, it's uh, like, no, it doesn't translate. Miss, Mr. Right. V Games and Toys, Ruben Soto is still still sticking around on YouTube. He's still on Discord and, um, <laughs> yeah. Oh, you got Ruben Soto? Hold on, hold on, hold on. We got the crucial link right here. Jay Jay, you know Ruben? Yeah, yeah, I'm subscribed to him. What's his YouTube channel? <laughs> That's Ruben. Ruben. You're the missing link. Ruben. We've been looking for Ruben. We thought he was dead. <laughs> no, he ain't. <laughs> we need Ruben's uh, information. Uh, I'll post the link right oh, here. Post, it, post the link to his shit, man. We're trying okay. to find Ruben. Done it. Done it. <coughs> I done it. Ruben is still around. <laughs> So, hey, Ruben might be mad at us. He's gonna be like, "Damn, they're talking about me like I'm dead on the video." <laughs> yeah, Ruben Soto is still around, man. Ruben Soto. He he literally uh, four hours ago he did uh, upload a, a Transformers Red Robot Enhanced Design Megatron. See, and I would have checked yeah. out the video. I would have checked out his video, but I didn't <laughs> know it up. He didn't tell us the links and then. Yeah, he he. Well, this is basically a new account for him, so. Yeah. yeah, he was cool though. He was cool. My my buddy's a little rough. My like you, know, we poke fun, man. We're real people. We don't mean no harm and nothing. We say we joke around. We you know what I'm saying. We're just we we're numb to the world. We're older, man. So we, we're fucking around. We were just joking around with him and shit. We wanted to make sure he didn't take it personal. And we yeah. never got the information. He popped in on the chat, and we never got his information to find out how to sell him. So help help your boy out. Help Ruben out, JJ. You got his information, man. Spread the word on Ruben so we can we can get him. We can show Ruben some love, man. Yeah, I'm, yeah, glad to hear he's, uh, I'm on I'm on I'm on the channel now. I'm about to hit him with a style. So. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, he got it. <laughs> yep, he got another sub. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Hey, put, put his link in the chat, man. Yeah, Ruben. Yeah, Ruben is uh, yeah, so yeah, like definitely. We're gonna get Ruben. Ruben gonna be on next week's show. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna get Ruben on next week's show. And British B, we gonna we're gonna finally convince British B into coming back. Okay, there we go. I got his channel. I'm finna sub him right now. Ruben, you just got another subscriber. As soon as I can sign in on there. <laughs> oh, damn it. Password was changed six months ago. Trying another way. Come on. Text me. Yeah, well, you got to verify with your phone and all kind of stuff now. Mm hmm. Uh, Ninja Bell, sleepy time almost for this old dog. <laughs> yeah. Definitely. Uh, we, we are subbed. All notifications. Yeah, Ruben. For, oh, 23 minutes ago, Ruben, Ruben's Ruben's on active now. Yep, he's definitely very active. Ruben might be watching. Who knows? I don't know. <laughs> hey. Leave a comment on this video. Yeah, man. Yeah, Ruben. Ruben, if you're watching, if you're watching, yeah. join in, Ruben. <laughs> Ruben has subbed to my channel as well, so yeah. Yeah, Ru Ruben ain't doing too bad there. Yeah, Ruben got two hundred and sixty-one subscribers now. Now that I know, now that I know how to subscribe to him, he didn't leave any of his information when he was in the video. Not that I recall. I might have drunk too many beers. Oh, you look at that, John Simmons just subscribed to my channel. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, John John Simmons. He uh, he likes GI Joe stuff, but he's he's real. He's cool and he supports man. 
I got to get uh, get him together in order, man. Nice. I got to I got to throw on uh, <clears throat> I need to he he emailed me too. I'm going to hit you up on the email, man. Uh if you do PayPal or something, we can set up uh, we can set up a throw on this week, man. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I got to do some boats and trying to finish up these his tanks and a lot going on, boy. It's a busy time. Busy time. Got you buying Hot Wheels. I just noticed, like, I went to my GameStop the other day, yo. They started racking, stacking up on some Hot Wheels. I'm like, Jackie. I was like, what? Got GameStop over here selling Hot Wheel cars, man? Oh, okay. For real? I didn't realize they did that. Bro, I had a whole little shelf just straight Hot Wheels. Wow. I didn't know that. Hey, Dollar Tree be the lick for me. I found a bunch of them turtle vans in Dollar Tree. Oh, for real? Yeah. <laughs> That's what's I grab, whenever I see them little movie shits and shit like that, man, I always grab them. Like, Hot Wheels, Hot Wheels is that fallback, man. When you go in looking for a Transformer or or something else and you can't fall it, you like, fuck it. And you walk by the Hot Wheels and you're like, man, that Corvette looks pretty cool. <laughs> 97 cents. I'm going to go ahead and buy that shit, you know. Jay Hall, uh, 43, about to be 44 in three more weeks. Nah, I see. Fuck, fuck, fuck Let's fuck do a celebration live stream for his birthday. <laughs> Just full of cars by the end of the week. <laughs> Jay, I'm, I'm surprised that Jay Holler is older than me, actually. If he's talking about his age, I didn't know Jay Holler was older than me. I thought he was young, man. <laughs> well, I mean. JB on the grind, boy. JB up early. He be up late, up late, early, up early. He's on that hunt, boy. Mr. V games and toys. I'm 37, about to be 38 next year. Yo, Mr. V, oh, like I always say, Mr. V, you can't, have, about, you can't have uh, MVP without Mr. V, bro. Yeah. He a legend. Yeah. So that's my that's my brother from another mother, right there. Yes. So. <laughs> uh, I'm about to turn 20 next month, next year, so. Yeah, I'm one month away to become 20 years old, and I'm gonna say bye bye to my teenage years. Yeah. Oh man, <laughs> hold, yeah. hold on to it, boy. Hold on to it as long as you can. Hold, hold on to it for a few more days. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I don't know how it is in your in your country, but like like I said, once you hit that 21 point and you can kind of do adult shit legally. <laughs> Yeah, that shit opens Ninja up, flood, shit opens up floodgates, man. That shit opens up floodgates. It's Jay like, Hall. oh, I can do this uh, shit yeah. now without, without, I, I ain't got to drink my shit in a paper bag. No <laughs> <laughs> damn, Ninja Bill, Ninja Bill said he was in Iraq at 20. Damn, boy. Wow, Appreciate damn. your service, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Appreciate your service, Ninja yeah. Bill. Jay Hall, JJ, a youngster? Uh, yes, I'm definitely a youngster, but I'm definitely a... A mature youngster, so yeah, I'm really because I know what I'm doing. I'm doing, uh, I'm doing, I'm doing my reviews more professionally this time around. <laughs> Trying to be more like uh, you guys, <laughs> yeah. And ten years to send out packages, JJ. <laughs> <laughs> Pop the truck, boys. They about to be 45 like the cult, boy. Like the cult. <laughs> it works every time. <laughs> I mean, we, all, we, all get, we, all, we all young in mind, though, man. That's another thing about toy collectors, man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, we all, most of us are all good people. And, unless you unless you buying the toy that we want, and then we can be shitty. <laughs> <coughs> All right, real quick, I got a question. I got a question. So I was asking a friend of mine this a couple of weeks ago. So yeah. oh, no. like, we were talking oh, about no. the toys we hey, like. Jay Hall is going to break uh, Mr. Smith. <laughs> What's that? What's that, man? He said, I'm an old guy that likes favors more than G1. Don't kill me. Do your son. Do you. Like I said, I can't listen. My opinion is my opinion. <laughs> uh, hey, but Jay, Jay fucks with G1 too, though. He gets all that shit too, man. I still love G1. I like G1 and Babers, you know, all together. I like Beast Wars. Um, don't kill me, but I, I still like Beast Machines. <laughs> That's another one I don't do, man. I don't do it. Yeah, I'm, I'm good. But... When, they started going out, when they did all the animals, I was like, yeah, it don't make sense. They're still metal animals. Like, I didn't, yeah. 
Look at this. I fuck with the Dinobots. I fuck with the Dinobots. Now, there's a couple of animals I fuck with. But... Yeah. I, I, I put it like this. All the different types of Transformers out there, no matter what you like, whether it's Unicron, Trilogies, Beast Machines, Bayformers, it keeps Transformers relevant. Mm-hmm. So that's why I can say that's why I sit there and go, listen, I don't, you like what you like. It keeps it keeps it relevant. Yeah. Even this, even this one keeps it relevant. It, yeah. 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 Well, everything, everything Transformers keeps it relevant. Yep. Yeah. Where we have options. Yep. And that's a even, beautiful, and, and when you're a collector, that's a beautiful fucking thing. Yeah. <laughs> Is options. Yep. Yeah. Yes, options are always good because, you know, third-party companies, there are a lot of third-party companies producing, like, the same characters, and people can get to choose which one they like better. Oh, you know, which one they want to buy a oh, character, either extra files or fans' toys, anything. <coughs> you know, options are there. But, you know. But G1, G1 pulls that bread, though, boy. Yeah, G1 is yeah. getting the money getter. G1 is, G1 is Cobra. Okay. G- G- with it. Yeah, All right. definitely. G1 will always be my uh, cup of tea right now. Um, I used to um, yeah, I used to say Babers would be my favorite franchise, but now when I look at the Siege and Earthrise and Kingdom and... Uh, you yeah. know, Beast Wars coming out, the Bumblebee movie as well. Got G1 you can, you, can, you can go to that well and you will always pull water. You know what I'm saying? With G1, that's it's almost guaranteed. You will pull water in that well. It, it, for it to dry out, you would have to do some real fuckery. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You can't, like, you can't like, kill it. Like, 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 like Disney Star Wars level fuckery, you would have to do. Hey, but G1 you still can't. Well dry out. You still can't murder G one though. Like it's like it's engraved in stone. You can't murder G one. You can you can try to twist the story beyond it, but like what what came out in the eighties is written in stone. That shit people are always gonna pass that that story along and that's, it's that's straight. Gospel. That's gospel. Yeah, that's gospel. <laughs> yeah. 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 Look, you, at, look, 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 look at we all right now. Look at look at this earth rise. You're going back to the well. Yeah. Yeah, if you make a Volkswagen be if you make a Volkswagen Bumblebee, that bitch gonna sell. If you make a semi truck, if you make a one of them old flat front trucks like Prime, that bitch gonna sell. Yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. So like I said, that well, it'll, it'll take a lot for that well to go down. Yeah. yeah. And Kingdom Puffer is gonna sell too. Asking what comes after? Because like Kingdom comes. Oh man! Like, like I said, I was telling JJ, I was like, I would like to see some of the Japanese stuff. Like, we need a Star Saber. Oh man! Uh, I, I wish I had. That was a masterpiece Star Saber back in the day. There yeah, is a masterpiece Star Saber, but we never got a Hasbro Star no. Saber. No, we never got it. No. But like I said, that's part of stuff. Like we've they've touched on a few of the Japanese figures. Here yeah, and they, there, man, yeah, they but never they really haven't dipped into it deeply, and I think like, come on now, it's about that time. Yeah, I've touched everything else. Yeah, like that jet fire they made, remote that motherfucker into a, a star saber. Hey, you, shit. you know, like honestly, man, the way they see it, it's not. It's kind of. It's it, it's not our. It's not our cult. Our transformer culture, maybe. Is how they view it. It's it's not. They didn't air it over here on our TV. But 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 yeah. they are. But they still make toys of them. Like like I said during the Titans Return, they dipped in those beast ones, like the Twin yeah. Dragon. That's all Japanese cartoons. I think for that stuff, we're gonna be stuck. We're gonna be stuck. I don't know, man, because we did get we got a uh, the King Poseidon or whatever the the remake the the white one that is. Was that Hasbro? That was Hasbro. That was Hasbro. And that's okay, the- so I guess it's, I guess it's feasible. The original ones were the Japanese mm-hmm. cartoons. The Z-Cons never came out in G1. They were all Japanese cartoons. Wow. And those yeah. motherfuckers sold out. Like, you know how much they are if you try to get them now? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. My home has yeah. got a set right now that I... Just, that's, I yeah. that's how I saw it after, because there is a fan base for that Japanese shit. Yeah. Like you saw what they did with uh, Overlord. Hey, my my homeboy Iron Ken, he's got one so I think he still got it. He's got one so fucking sick, man. He's it's kitted out with with feet and and like custom hands, and he's he's done all kind of custom work to it. 
I want to say that he was selling that shit for six hundred dollars on eBay, and and he he had pulled it down. <laughs> Me and him were gonna work out. We were gonna work out some kind of barter with the GI Joe vehicles I'm making for it. But I need money. I need money to get supplies. It ain't about a toy, you know what I'm saying? I feel you on that. So shit, man. But his, his shit's nice as fuck, uh, man. Okay. Um. All right. I have to go. Um. I have to go right now. I'm um a bit hungry right now. I'm having okay. lunch. All right. Yeah. yeah. That's All cool. Right. Thanks for being on the show, JJ Prime Reviews. Anybody here, if you didn't subscribe to him already, subscribe to this man. He's, yeah, he's the hardest man. working man on YouTube. Yeah. He's on, he's on 24 <laughs> hours a day. Y'all he's fuck the hardest really? working man in Malaysia. Y'all holla at your boy. <laughs> Peace out, guys. Peace All right. Be everyone, easy, man. Guys. Have a good one. Yep. yep. All right. So, and then there were two. <laughs> Like Bruce would say, get the fuck out of here. We got somebody else. <laughs> Let me post the link up, man. We'll find somebody else to replace JJ. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> in the spirit of Bruce, since he didn't come to the chat or anything tonight, like, he's he's probably he's probably booed up, spending time and shit. <laughs> yeah, sometimes it be like that, bro. Yeah, boy. You gotta get it in. You gotta get it in. You want, you, you want to stay happy, you got to make them happy. You feel me? Yeah. <laughs> happy wife, happy life. That's what they say. That's what they say. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, Mr. V, what you doing, man? Why you sitting there playing in the chat? Act like you ain't got a, you ain't got a cam, son. It's not from Uh-oh. My man, Mr. V, he be, he just be, he be, he be parking a lot of pimping in the chats. Laying <laughs> low. He's just laying low. Listen, like I said, he he a legend, bro. Yeah, let's see what the chat is talking about here. Fucking uh, yeah, Jay Holler talking about them C cons, them ships. I could never catch them to order either, man. Nah, they they the, when they dropped them, they were I think they were like Hasbro Selects, yeah, or something like that, and they they sold out immediately. Then when they reissued them, they bumped up the fucking price. Like yeah. the main body is like a hundred and something dollars, and we talking Combiner War type figures yeah, yeah and he talking about just one of them alone is 80 something dollars i'm like get the fuck out of here bro hey that's why we got a free wee jang man hashtag free, free wee jang, jang. <laughs> word give me give me a knock yeah. right about now so. yeah. we got to get that man free uh, I don't know if you caught the uh if you caught the stream last night man i have my my custom free wee jang t-shirt so you, you can go <laughs> back and check it out, man. We, oh, yeah. we, we can prov we're gonna provide them because we want to spread the word uh, free Wee Zhang. <laughs> I, I, I listen. I always had I always had a debate like people say like is knockoffs bad? Do they hurt the business? And I'm like I don't think they do. They just facilitate for people who ain't got that kind of money. We weren't gonna buy it anyway. <laughs> yeah, we were gonna buy it anyway. And it's like okay, hey, I get a cheaper version. And nowadays. Knockoffs are doing better. Oh, we got than David Hill running in. Look, we got David Hill. What up, Dave? David. <laughs> David. <laughs> David, you're on. You're on. Uh, what up? What up? <laughs> What's up, man? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we hear you, man. What's up, man? Chilling, man. Chilling. How you yeah. doing? Uh, <laughs> Hey, so uh, giving a sneak peek of a project I'm working on. So what you got? What you got? What you got? Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. He he showed me a picture of it. I I get to see it a little. Bit. I got to see it a little bit better. He showed me a picture, but that shit's tight, man. What's up, bro? Yeah, the photo of the cats there. So yeah, we'll we'll give for him. Oh shit. Thank you, thank you, man. Yeah, we we're, we're talking we're talking about KOs right now. Yeah, that shit is tight. Yeah, I miss I miss the KOs, man. And sometimes, it's, like I said, they, nowadays KOs are making better shit than has qualities better. Like how you how you how you making better shit than the actual company, and you supposed to be the knockoff. Okay, oh, yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, uh, so uh, if we Zhang, we Zhang come, I, I, you know, I, I really think it, it makes uh, it makes it like, why are they charging so much money? Why is Hasbro charging so much money? Because they can. If, if I can get a hot rod for $37, why do y'all want $100 for it, you know? Because we put the car and tell me on the box, that's why. That shit looks good, though, there, David Hill. It does look good, man. And that's uh, from a Spider-Man figure, right? Appreciate it, man. Trying to trying to hook you up, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's a Spider-Man. That's a Spider-Man figure as a base, I believe. Yeah, and Weijang adds diecast. Right, I see a, a six-inch uh, basic Spider-Man figure. Yeah, not a whole lot of articulation, but um, yeah, got some uh, body armor. Sure. Like I said, that's a that's a skill I wish I had to do like the custom and all that. Uh, I, I, I ain't got that kind of finger dexterity for the patience. <laughs> I'm a, I'm gonna get to it, man. If I can ever get the time, man, I'm gonna start fucking with shit like that. I just gotta make time. Cause if I really really gonna be in the craft, so you've been working. I'll be I'll be I'll be, I'll be I'll making rest That's the <laughs> shit. So all them guns and shit, like you're making those? Uh, no, it's a uh, kind of a uh, dollar store figure uh, uh, that I grabbed up just for like the gun and the backpack and like the body armor. So I'm chopping it out of the, uh, the actual figure and then uh, hollowing it out. Okay. Uh, so it can, in fact, be placed upon the Spider Man figure. Yeah, oh, okay, okay, okay. So it's like a custom Joe kind of kind of shit going on. Okay. That's going to be tight, man. That's going to be tight. I wish I had the time, man. That's <laughs> it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, do. Yeah, I'm yeah, to navigate yeah, it around. Kind of the background here for you. So, wait, wait, you learn how to like, you know, get in uh, custom figures? Oh, I ain't got time, man. I'm always staying busy. Okay. Just, po just poking around, probably just looking around on, you know, shit. YouTube is a. Oh, me, uh, I started out years ago, uh, tabletop miniatures, uh, doing that and. Just doing okay. transformers and stuff, and uh, oh, you did transformers over, like too? action figures. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, he likes transformers. He's uh, I've sent him a couple of three D printed things that I did for, I think it was the Red Alert, Sideswipe, and all of them, I believe. That's what's up. Yeah, some like uh, shoulder cannons and shit, and guns, I believe. I think it was. Oh yeah, oh yeah, and uh, piece of Starscream like yeah, cast yeah, up, man, big time. Yeah, it was a crown, yeah, a crown for Starscream too, a coronation crown. It was all sorts of stuff. Yeah, oh, that's what's up, man. A little, a little, uh, a little fun packet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, Jay, uh, Jay's talking about the iron hired feet, man. And yeah. I, let me look. Let me look into the options on that, man. I know there's. I got something for him. Yeah, I heard yeah, the iron guy's feet are pretty janky. I haven't really looked at mine yet, but I heard that uh, they, they ain't all they cracked up to be. I think I got them right around here somewhere. Where did I put? Where did I put iron hide? Where did I take? I put ratchet in the house. Yeah, here he is. Yeah, this is. Oh, let me drop this. Now, uh, Fun B uh, Studios has a uh, upgrade kit for the feet. Oh, for real? Oh shit! I get that for the free then, because I, I well not for the free. I pay for their little monthly membership, they uh monthly supporter thing, so I can get that. That's what's up. So yeah, I haven't got a chance to really look at his feet, but I heard it was looking kind of. 
Oh, M, M plus yeah, out. Yeah, a pretty basic, or a pretty good uh, start, but then uh, Lazy Eyebrow re Reviewer wound up doing some tweaks on the uh, designs. So uh, he even posted it on his channel. Hey, uh, Input is catching well, Input. Yeah, everybody wish him a good night. Good night, Input. Input. We love you. Have a good night, Input. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, input does. Well, he's he's, shit, man. he's an honorary Georgia boy. Yeah, yeah. Smith's a Georgia boy, too. Yeah, I'm out here. YouTube, YouTube rapping, boy. We rapping for the toys in Georgia. Also, got a motherfucker to be snatching oh, okay. shit up. <laughs> yeah, Smith, uh, uh, what section of Georgia you in, man? Uh, Mankin. Tell you what, we better get deep. <laughs> this shit is ugly, man. How do they do that shit? Okay. Man? All right, now I know Kaz is out there uh, in in Augusta area. I'm up here uh, by uh, Stone Mountain in Atlanta. Oh, okay, okay, okay. That's what's you up. Should, well, you should have good shopping up there, man. I bet you got a bunch of WalMarts around you. I think it might be delayed on his his end. I think yeah, he, got, he, got, he, got, he got a few minutes delay on his. Hell no, man. Brick and mortar is always dried up, man. There's too many scouts and uh, bots. <laughs> oh, Atlanta, yeah, Atlanta, you yeah, shit. Yeah, I don't, I don't even try to fuck with Atlanta when it comes to hunting because I already know the scouts picked that shit clean. Damn, boy. Hey, and it's like that too, man. You can see. Like them Netflix, the the I only got Bumblebee and the leader because I didn't have enough money. It's horrible. But I I bet you every one of them shits were gone as soon as I walked away from as soon as I walked away from them somebody else got them within minutes I bet. Like out here, out here, if you're not out here when they pull the bitches out the box, you yep, them. you ain't getting them. Yep, that's how it is here. Boy, when I seen that fucking box on the pallet, I saw a TR. Like, I haven't seen any uh, GI Joe in any of the stores up here. I saw a TRA Netflix. I slid that shit out and, and I, I, I discreetly walked down the aisle to where the Transformers was. I got my Bumblebee and the leader. I put the other shits on the peg for them so they wouldn't feel bad about me opening the box. <laughs> got the fuck out, boy. I hit my homeboys up. I was like, hey, Netflix Netflix at Dean's Bridge. You can grab them. Better get them. <laughs> it's motherfucking sad. I'm going to do y'all solid. <laughs> yep, yep. I put the whole box on the shelf for you. I just wanted my two Transformers, and I'm out. Man, man, help me help you. <laughs> but I, I would have... Man, I slick, I slick know enough people that wanted them shits. I would have bought the whole fucking box if I had yeah, the money, man. Up, man. I would have got the whole fucking box. Yeah, like I said, my, my Walmart, they, they be late with this shit, but I'll be, I'll be on the grind, man. I got, I got other people searching for me, too. So it's like, yeah. anyway. Hey, but on but on a positive note too, a lot of the a lot of the people I'm hearing about, like actually up towards your area, I heard like in Snellville that they had a whole a whole display of them shits, man. So it might be, you know, there might still be hope, man. Listen, I I, I get lucky, and like I'll, I'll go all the way out to like one Robins. Go ahead. <laughs> Usually, I get lucky out there. None of us really had trouble getting the other Netflix shits. If we wanted them, we got, you know, we were able to get a hold of them in the end. We might not have got them off jump, but uh, we was able to get them. And then Bumblebee is two, is two to a case, but the scalpers, of course, they're going straight for him. Anybody, you know, they're, they're grabbing all the Bumblebees. I think that shit's like trending at $50 on, on eBay or something like that, man. If I was going to buy one from there. I got so tired of hunting Walmart for it. I was about to buy one. See, uh, like Transform, they don't touch it too much out here. It's mostly like around my area. It's all the Marvel Legends shit. Like they'll clean, everybody's buying up. Yeah, they'll clean that out. Hey, and y'all, the Marvel Legends collectors, I feel sorry for y'all now because y'all are competing with G.I. Joe too. Oh, G.I. Joe, you barely see that ever. Yeah, yeah. See, in my area, no one's buying that up. That's why I'm getting into it. 
<laughs> really? Bitch. Well, you need to get. Hey, we need to barter out. Then what? What are you seeing in your area? You ain't seeing Red Ninja, are you? Uh, yeah, the Marvel Legends. I get them on uh, clearance and shit. All of them. Oh, he's talking about the Marvels. I'm about to say the GI Joe. Hell one. no, man! Like I said, I don't. I don't see no GI Joe classified yeah. at all. I knew that, that was going. <laughs> That shit's like crazy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen but, no GI Joe classified at all. Have you have you checked GameStop? Because GameStop supposedly is supposed to be carrying GI Joe classified. It's it's very sparse though, because I've seen like maybe one or two figures once in a while. But once you see them, if you didn't pick it up, you ain't seen it the next time you go there. Yeah, whole Atlanta area, there is no GI Joe classified on the shelves anywhere. Well, that's that's what I'm saying. Uh, the Marvel Legends people, y'all are taking a dent from GI Joe too, because I I personally have bought some Marvel Legends shit just because I want the head to put on a GI Joe, or because I want I want one of the weapons or effects that they come with or some shit. So the GI, I mean the Marvel Legend collectors, y'all are taking a dent because GI Joe is dipping into the Marvel shit. So that they can paint them up. Oh, yeah, and, look, that's why I got into the uh, Marvel Legends and, and the Star Wars Black Series. Yeah, the, the Black Series. I, I was going to get a couple of them, too, man. Some of them can, like the the Stormtroopers, I figured they could be crossover uh, crossover Army Troopers. Kinda. Having something to do. Yep, yep. That fucking Yoda is a trip, though. They want twenty dollars for that little ass Yoda, man, and that's not cool. <laughs> Which yeah, one, yeah, though? Yeah. A regular yeah, Yoda, or baby Yoda. Custom squad of. Uh, they got the the fortieth working on the fortieth anniversary one. Oh, okay. It's real yeah. small. He's got like a snake. Oh, shit, man, that, that Mandalorian child is ten dollars. Yeah, yeah. And that shit's tiny. That's like two dollars of plastic. <laughs> Paying ten dollars for that plus tax. Not even. Like and now that I print and shit and you think about shit in grams, it's probably like it's probably yeah. like six grams. Six grams of plastic and they want ten dollars for that shit. That's crazy, bro. Oh no, Cash! We, we we can't be talking about too many grams, man. We gonna get in trouble with my PO. <laughs> we talk we talk about we talking about plastic grams, though, man. <laughs> I started to make that joke too. I started to say the print three uh, D printing is like the dope game. You weigh everything in grams. <laughs> when somebody when somebody says, uh, sure, 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 man. Sure, man. Somebody wants a his when somebody wants a his tank like oh man, that's a kilo man that's a kilo that's gonna <laughs> oh, shit. I'm telling you man that's a kilo of plastic for real it is like legit a kilo look charge them ten dollars a tenth. <laughs> yeah, yeah when I take it to the post office is there any reason this way is a kilogram. <laughs> <laughs> like you could, is there anything hazardous or dangerous? Nope, just plastic. <laughs> just plastic in it. <laughs> exactly two point two, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you. That's how you gotta. That's how you you gauge out your sales with with the three D prints. That's really how you gauge out your sales. The weight. They're gonna see you getting a bunch of plastic every week. They're gonna come to your house like, "We're gonna ask some questions." <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, I'm past that. I'm past that limit. I've got, I've got like fifty different rolls of colors. I've got a big stack of all kind of shit, man. Like you, you buy a stack just to do a weapon in one color, and then you, you stuck trying to figure out next time you're gonna use it for something. Yeah, I, got, I need more space, man. Uh, my, my brother-in-law, he's into the 3D printing. He made a, Look, I do the same thing with uh, paint. He and, made a uh, fucking Dr. Doom mask with his 3D printer. Yeah, I got, I need more space, man. He made a what with a 3D printer? Uh, Dr. Doom mask. Okay, hell yeah, hell yeah. And uh, fucking Thundercats, uh, Sword of Omens. 
Oh yeah, I know. I know what you're talking about. That shit took a long time for him to do it too. I bet. Yeah, man. He, but he be he be banging them out though. Yeah, yeah. That shit probably took him two or three weeks to do that sword though. I bet. I've wanted to do that shit myself, man. That shit. He painted it and everything, or yeah, yeah, all that shit, bro. Hell yeah. Does he got a channel? Uh, yeah, he got a channel. Shit, man, I'm gonna. Hold on, let me uh. Yeah, post post that up for me too, man. I'm gonna check that. Shit. Does he do it? Did he do a video with the sword, or does he? Uh, stuff? I'm not sure if he did the sword, but I know. Like he, he does like a whole like he he, he does like like three D print mask, a whole bunch of shit, bro. Damn, Jay, Jay said there's no more Joe tags in none of his targets. They say, don't even expect it. They ain't coming. Don't worry about it. They ain't coming. Not till January. Hey, what about that Viper, man? I want that fucking Viper so bad. That Viper does look fucking nice, bro. That red and blue. Man, for some reason, if, if a toy is red and blue, that shit, like Spider-Man, I, I'll buy all kind of Spider-Man shit because of that red and blue, boy. When you see those two colors together, the contrast. Oh, one red ninja. You got one? I've got three of them. I lucked up and I got three. I bought two at a pawn shop uh, for $36 a piece uh, a couple of weeks ago. No, no, I want one. Oh, you want one? Damn man, I hope I hope they're supposed. Man, no, I just want one man. I want to, I want to do a uh, uh, custom and put a Deadpool head on it, so I have a Deadpool ninja. Oh, that'd be tight. As black would be a perfect match. That'd be tight. Yeah. Well, hopefully they say January, man. Hopefully we're gonna see some more red ninjas in January. So. <laughs> man, I hope so. If, Look, if I don't I get one, man, grab right. me up one. Yeah, yeah. I was just about to say, if I see him, I'll grab you up one, man. G.I. Joe's been something you can't find. Like, I know where uh, at a game stop up the road, they've got a Scarlet, a Duke, and a Roadblock. And I might go back and get the Duke. I want to do a custom Duke with my head on it. <laughs> but I got to get a good 3D scanner to be able to scan my head up right. That shit yeah, would be like that. To, have, to have have you in front of yeah, your that's, toy. That, that'd be awesome, man. But no, I'd, I'd want a uh, Duke just for the body. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you got the score. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. That's the yeah, last Joe. Joe's a scarce boy. Listen, that shit was like crack. When I when I go to Walmart and I see something like a wave or something, and like I know see like listen, like you can't hesitate, like fuck it, you did. Cause you know if you you know if you if you hesitate and he's like, Oh, I'll come back later. No, like, there is no later. Oh yeah, it's real bad. Nope. <laughs> there is no later. I read, you better get I went, it. I went, to, I, went, I, went, I went to Walmart on a humble one time, and they had that whole strong guy wave. I was just like, I wasn't even planning on buying this, but I was like, "Fuck that! I don't know when I'm gonna see this shit again." Yeah, yeah. You gotta get it, man. If you don't, it's gone. You know it. He says you saw peaking. You like hold on. You like one, two, three, four. Oh shit! They got the whole wave. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. There's been so many times I went into Walmart and I skip on some shit and I go back the next day thinking I'm gonna find it. That shit gone. Nah. It is gone and everything else that came out in the box with it is gone. It's like, God damn. Like I seen the Mr. T. Uh somebody showed the Mr. T uh wrestling figure or whatever, the He Man Mr. <laughs> T thing. And I wanted to get that shit, right? The next day, I went to the store and I seen it. I ain't got the money for it though. I'm like, nah, I'm trying to get this Bumblebee and Alita One if I ever see him. Yeah, so yeah, I stuck, yeah, yeah. 
I stuck it. I, I even tried to hide that shit. Come back the next day when I had a few bucks on me, it's gone, man. Somebody done found it. And I, I do that shit too when I go to Walmart now because I know other people, like people hide shit. So I walk up and down the aisles looking around, looking around shit that I think is suspicious. <laughs> Cause they might have done hit the transformer. I want <laughs> shit. Yeah, I be I be looking at the top shelf. Be like, what, yeah. the, what the fuck is up there, bro? Yeah, <laughs> yeah motherfuckers be playing. Act like I can't yeah. reach. <laughs> and under the shelves, like they they had to remodel the fucking shelves in the toy department because people were sticking. You know, they used to have a little black and skirt around the, the bottom. Shelf. Yeah. yeah, people were putting it in that That's shit. Space underneath the bottom shelf, in between the floor and the shelf. Yep. I did that shit one time. I was up in when Toys R Us was still open. And my girl was like, What you doing? I'm like, Yo, motherfuckers, be hot as shit under these motherfuckers. You yep. gotta check them. Yep. You gotta check them. Yep. You act like you act like I'm the only person searching in the game. No. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> hey, I bumped into a dude at the flea market one time. I, I had went out to the flea market and there was a table that had a bunch of Transformers on it. And me and this other dude were looking around, and we're both like kind of rushing around the table because we try. I don't want him to see nothing that I want, and he get it. And <laughs> first so we're walking around the table and shit. And then once we're done scanning and we get everything that we want, we start talking about Transformers. And he say, when our Toys R Us went out of business, he said that uh, they were tearing up the shelves that he found the Optimus Prime. I hit his shit right. <laughs> and I forgot. I hit it. It was a masterpiece, Optimus Prime. And he said he found that shit, and they couldn't find it in the system. He ended up paying twenty five dollars for it. Damn. And he was brag. He was bragging about, like we were bragging about, uh, you know, cool, uh, good finds, cheap finds that we had got. So he was telling me about that shit, and I was like, motherfucker, that was the Optimus Damn. Prime that I hit. <laughs> <laughs> It was like, shit, it's all fair and love and war, man. I was like, yeah, it's all good, man. But it's funny, though. Uh, that's, that's, that's wild. Did I bump into the dude that bought the fucking one that I hid? What are the odds, you know? That's what I, that's what I say. It's a small world after all. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, man. What, you, what, what you hide under the shell comes to the light. <laughs> That's crazy, bro. Yeah, man. <laughs> I actually got to meet the dude that stopped me from getting the prime. Like, I remember I was, I was trying to hunt for that Red Hulk that came out a while back. And every time I check on it, they're like, oh, it's available. It's available. As soon as I get there, every, every everybody that works me act like they the fuck I'm talking about. Like, oh, yeah. man. I know, I know one of y'all know somebody that's probably yeah. you know, holding this shit for a motherfucker. One. Like, get out of here. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Like Ollie's, Ollie's had a Hulk toy. I, that might have been that Red Hulk that you're talking about. Ollie's had that shit at one of our stores and had a whole case of it. Come the, uh, the one dude bought a whole uh, fucking case. Outback Hulk, just to have a Hulk. Yeah, yeah. But I finally, I finally got my hands on the Red Hulk, so I'm good in the streets now. I still need to get me a Hulk. I've got a. I want to have at least the Avengers. I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna get all the fucking comic book characters like that. But I did want to have at least the Avengers. I got Iron Man, Spider Man, and Black Panther, and and Thor, Captain America. I need to get Hulk. I'm gonna try to have that little lineup of Avengers, maybe. I'm kind of doing Marvel Legends now. I'm kind of cherry picking because I built my whole X Men team. I got everybody good now. Yeah. Good. Especially since they re-released that rogue. That was the last piece of the puzzle. I pick up that new Venom figure. Oh yeah, I fucking love that shit, yo. Oh I, I do I do want that fucking Venom pool. Ah, yeah. Look. I got ah, here Venom's gonna inspire. I love this shit, man. Like I said, I'll pick the I'll pick up the rebound. I want the rebound. <laughs> You want the repainted one? I, I want the, I want when they give him the classic color look. This shit, I love this shit, boy. Yeah, the classic uh, Spider-Man outfit, like the, the, the spider on the front. Oh, okay, I got you. So you know they're gonna do it. Yeah. 
it's too good of a thing not to do. Hey, this shit, boy. This shit. Well, I love this shit, man. I'm impressed. Yeah, sometimes the hell probably will give you some bangers. I kept when I opened this up the night that I opened it up on the live stream. I kept fucking with it. I just had it. I was just randomly just come out. And, ah! <laughs> <laughs> this shit is awesome, man. Yeah, I love the Venom figure. But you're right, man. If they do the, I didn't think about that part. I'm not real. Yeah, he's got that. There you go. There you go. Ah! <laughs> That shit is awesome, though. But yeah, I'm not super geared at the comic book type of shit like that, so I didn't Tell think about that. Grab one. Yeah, man, it's well worth it. It's well worth it, man. That shit is well worth it. Yeah, I'm probably going to just buy the whole way just for that build for you, uh, Plus, I do, do a couple of little symbiotes to finish off my, my symbiote team. Yeah, I want to grab up uh, one of the new Carnage figures. Like I always like Carnage over uh, Venom. He didn't come with no no parts though, I guess, because he's so damn big, man. They all the plastics in the figure. Oh, that Hulk's tight too, man. Yeah, that's from, uh, from the that's from the video game, right? right. I'm gonna turn this guy into a uh, custom, custom maestro. maestro. Nice. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Outback, Outback Hulk. Hulk. Game stop. I was hoping they would make a Maestro at some point because Maestro is badass. I had to pick this shit up too, man. For the Ooh, fuck of it. That's a nice. Oh, who's making up Master Chiefs now? Uh, is that McFarland? Oh yeah, man, that's my favorite version. Like I said, the uh, the Outback Hulk is a is a good base. I think it might be McFarland. I'm not. I'm looking for the box here. Come on. That's McFarland, ain't it? Oh, yeah. I think it is McFarland. Uh, three four three Industries. WCT Xbox. Look, I'm also looking for uh, one of those uh, 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 Warhammer 40,000 well, Space Marines. It's it, 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 probably not McFarland because it, 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 it would have guys. to somewhere. McFarland does not hide his, his brand. That would if that was a McFarland, it would have been on the front of that label. Right, that, that that's it. what I see as far as branding. 343 WCT Xbox. Yeah, that's not McFarland. But that looks yeah. good as fuck, though. It's, it's straight. It doesn't have... <clears throat> It's oh, not yeah, a real yeah. Adam Crunch, but there's a little play right there, or whatever. You know that rotation. What's he come with the no. rifle? He come with a rifle and a pistol. Yeah, he came with a bunch of guns. I'm not sure where where to put them at. Uh, trying to find. I can't remember where I put the weapons at. I got boxes all over where I've been opening the past couple of weeks on live stream. There it is, there it is, yeah, yeah. Okay, so it comes with with that. Okay. The then a shitload of hands. Okay. That's what's up. So I'm not I'm not if I find one, I'm not gonna pick that up. Yeah. I, <laughs> and they're a little bit taller too. I think. I think he's probably like seven inches, maybe. It's... Okay, that's nice. That's 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 about legends uh, scale. Yeah, a little bit, a little bit taller. But, uh, the master chief is supposed to be like uh, she's about seven the foot four or some shit like that. In the game. Yeah, uh, and I kind of I figured. Uh, so what I was, the, I guess the way I'm gonna display him, I'm gonna do a warthog that's big enough for him, and I'm gonna sneak it into the GI Joe shit. Like, uh, you know, he's still military, 
He's like in Space Force though, or something. So special. He had to come, yeah, he had to come down to Earth for a second to nice. whip Cobra. You know, and he brought his warthog to fuck the Cobras up with it. And it kind of looks the suit. If you have a GI Joe figure, it kind of looks like you know they the character would fit with all the armor and shit. They'd be that big probably. How hot would that be if you repainted them to kind of look like Cobra Commander? Oh shit! Or even a souped-up Viper. Yeah. Or a New Age Bat. Oh, even better. Yeah. Shit, paint that into a uh, Bat Trooper. Yeah, yeah, yeah. (laughs) Make a chest plate. Make a chest plate like the old Bat shield. Just saying, cut that up. Put it in there. Yep. That shit would be tight. But he isn't he isn't as posable as, as the G.I. Joe figures either though. Nah, he's got too much armor. He's too bulky. Yeah. I mean he's got his toes move and shit. And he's got ankle pivot and swivel or whatever. And the toe like the toe actually bends. Oh uh, damn, he ain't got no pegs for us to be put in a stand, huh? No, nah, no pegs. Uh, no pegs. I hate to see it. That's all right, though. Yeah. Man. You paint him up as a custom bat, he can just be in the background. True. He's got some kind of bat. I don't know. I guess maybe the right <laughs> one on his back. But shit, he's, he's solid, man. Like, he can you get some poses out of him and shit. He look like he's got a, he got a, he got a butterfly. Butterfly. Um, uh oh, oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> like brand new like I know. yeah it it is slightly double jointed here yeah he got double joints yeah what about the shoulders like is it like a butterfly in there uh this shit uh it's like a rotating ball yeah, so it's kind of it's a little bit like a, like a. But you can also looks like I can hold the ball. Yeah, I can hold the ball and then rotate that too. Okay, see, so he's got he's got he's got the uh, articulation. Yeah, no bicep swivel though, but he just got the double elbow, so he can kind of act like he's getting communications or some shit maybe. Or... And then the other hand is the pointing hand. It's like, oh, what? He's over there. <laughs> I don't know, man. Just getting a fucking fix because there's no GI Joe to buy. Shit, this is damn shit, man. Like, yeah. you know, man, scalpers, scalpers, is uh, really stick out here here with your tank, I guess, man. Huh. And they're buying all of these fucking things too because now, now of course, since I got this one, I want the red, blue. Yeah, you got three red ninjas talking about you can't get a GI Joe fix. I can't find none. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, a, I'm having to make some. Look, I got, I got to make some custom Joes for you, man. <laughs> now, like I said, I know where Scarlet, Scarlet Duke, and, and Roadblock are right now. Goddamn shame. <laughs> <laughs> That's why, like I said, that's why, I, like I was, I was ready to kind of get in on the GI Joe, but I was like, the way I saw how sparse it was, I was like, yeah, I can't do it. Exactly, exactly. it is. Man. Boy, it was a fight, man. It was a fight to get every damn thing I had. I had to be. Yeah, listen, I was ready to buy in. I was ready to buy in. I was like, ooh, this is. I mean, like I said, I wasn't crazy about Cobra Commander, but I know they was gonna bring a classic version of him at some point. But it was like, let me get in on these. The Destrum look good. You know, Duke and all of them look good. Not, not, not cartoon accurate, but I know that'll come later. But I was like, yeah. it was hard to find, man. I'm like, like that's how uh, me and Iron Kim, we got super tight, man, because we both were getting up first thing in the fucking morning and going to Target. And then if one Target didn't have, we got two Targets in the area. So if one target didn't have that shit, we go hauling ass to the other target and we bump into other people that have been standing at that one at seven o'clock in the morning waiting for the door to open. Shit. So like, well, we fought for we fought for our shit, boy. We fought to get our little our little bit of shit, man. 
Shit, you got her. <laughs> See, you yeah. should split up, man. Like, you take one, him, him take the other, you know? We did. We did. We we started doing we started doing shit like that. I'd be like, all right, bro, I'm going to go to the other one. At first, we, we were both leaning on one, though, because it usually has a higher success rate. So, but once we got we got cool with it, we was like, all right, man, look, they're going to have two Cobra Troopers in, in the case or whatever. So you get one. If, if if there's one, you get that shit and you hold the other one until I get there. And whoop, 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 whoop. But boy, we had to bust ass to get what we got. <laughs> yeah, you really gotta go through with intelligence to, to find something to figure out that like hell yeah well i live by pop finder man i was dreaming about that shit dog i wake up in the middle of the motherfucking night boy like <laughs> let me check for baroness let me see if baroness is finally in now oh they say they're getting two of them today and you go down there and you talking to the employees oh we can't find it we can't find it or if you call up there they'd be like uh we're busy we can't we can't check right now and just like, taking you through all the shit, and then the employees be hiding shit and selling it yeah. too, man. They be holding it for someone else. Yeah, man. It's like fuck. That's why, I like, when they be acting like, "Oh, uh, we can't find it," like motherfucker, you probably be staring at that motherfucker every time you walk That's in. That's how it is up here. You, in, you staring in at that motherfucker. Yeah. Check the online inventory; it'll say something's in stock, but the employees can't find it. It ain't in the back. It's just gone. No, they'll stand. They'll be in the back for five minutes, staring at that motherfucker. Act like they come out. Oh, we, we, it, it ain't no more. And you sitting there like, yo, you should say it's in stock right now. Come on. Now. Hey, our our targets. No, we don't play that shit though. We'll double check, man. If somebody tell us no, we'll go some. We'll go to another representative. We'll be like, hey, can you look this number up in your shit, yeah, exactly. man? Exactly. See that shit. And we've had it. We've had them. We've had them double check, and then somebody else go back and get what we was looking for, man. They'd be like, "Yeah, it was right. It was right there. It was right there in the food section." Or they done moved it over to another section to try to hide it and shit. <laughs> Found it next to the frozen pea. Yeah, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Being there, like, man, telling these people, like, I ain't no fucking scalper, man. I'm just trying to get one down. I'm trying to get one baroness for my little collection, man. What's I good? Buy, I ain't trying to buy too many of these motherfuckers. Just give me one. And then you see somebody, then you see people post stuff on Instagram, 20 down, 20 down motorcycles. Like I seen a pic, I don't know who it is, and I hope I hope they ain't watching, whatever, whatever. But they had a picture of like like 10 or 15 Baroness's bikes kicked over. The, the, the snake eyes had been kicked them shits and they was all locked over. It was just like a slap in the face. It was like, man, for real, bro. Like you got fifteen damn bearings. Oh, okay, okay. I'll watch that. Man. <laughs> to be, you know, put out there on blast, man. Yeah, man. Like, come on. That, that's cool, cool photo, man. But I hope you had eight friends. I hope you had fifteen friends that let you borrow that motorcycle for that shot, man. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> Cause we out here fighting to get Baron. It's just that crazy. That word. Just say, just save a play of one. Can I get one? Yeah, for real. For real, for real. Yeah. Like. And then, hey, and it be times I go to Target. I go to Target and I'll be like, hey, can I get two Cobra Troopers? Cause you, my let me see someone post going. up on Instagram by, by my area and they got fifteen of uh, something flexing like they got them all in stock. Now I'm gonna go rob their ass. <laughs> <laughs> Kicking down those for toys, boy. <laughs> wake up, wake up, and your figures come up missing. <laughs> <laughs> Straight <laughs> up. <laughs> oh, Be like, yo, what happened to all my baronesses? <laughs> they gone, bitch. Come on, man. You're flexing. You're flexing on the ground. They're gone. Now. <laughs> oh, man. I done, I done crept up on you while you were sleeping, man. <laughs> you know about that. Yeah, hey. The, the fucking troopers though, man. So I go in, I go in, I be like, hey, can I get two troopers? Like, can I just get two troopers? Hey, like, look, I'm one sure or whatever. Guy, man. I'll come right through the, the roof and drop on them like Batman. Like Batman. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I'll be trying to buy a trooper. I try to buy two troopers. They be, oh no, we can only sell one. It's a hot item. Da 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 da. Whoop do whoop wow. Okay, all right, that's what's up, man. But then I go. I come back to the same target the next day and I see a motherfucker walking with four boxes of them to the register. 
It's like, man, what part of the game is that? Well, and nice. I go, and I went and talked to the dude. I was like, so I'm saying, yesterday you told me I could only get one, but I see a cat walking up there with four of them this morning, man. What's good, man? Oh, what? Well, well, they they changed the policy on it or whatever. It's like, no, man, that was your friend, bro, or that's somebody getting it for you or some shit, man. <clears throat> that's why I couldn't buy two of them yesterday because you needed all of them, man. Yeah. That'd be that bullshit right there. Uh-huh. <laughs> Look, that's, that's why you should take you a, a, a big booty girl over. in there with you, man. Have her run distraction for you. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I like when they when they do a re-release because then it's like they be out there on, on eBay butt hurt because like, that shit your shit just turned to worthless. You should get yeah. worthless. They, re, they reissue. Like, Ooh, I know you feeling salty now. You you invested in that shit in. Now, now there's no payoff. <laughs> now you now you st- now you stuck with a bunch of baronisms and you can't do nothing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You can't give them away. See, I, I love a reissue, man. That allows yeah, other people to go ahead and fill in those blanks in their uh, collection. I think the motorcycle. I think the Baroness motorcycle is done, though, man. I think the next one we get is going to be a, a different paint scheme for her. She's going to have either the blue suit or the red suit. Yeah, probably. probably they, they still gonna milk us. They still gonna milk us. So they probably gonna make it a two pack. Like that's the rumor right now that they're gonna do a two pack with Destro. I hope it's that red suit, man. Yeah, that'd be tight, man. We gonna get it all. They are gonna give us everything because they know we are gonna buy it. But, oh yeah, GI Joe. GI Joe is is a pretty deep well too. You got you got a lot of characters to flush the out. M three, uh, uh, he's got some fire ass Baron ass uh, statues. Yeah, he does, man. He does. M three's got he's got a lot of fucking cool toys, man. He's got a lot of cool toys. <clears throat> like cats right now, they going hot for they they waiting for that shipwreck. When they come out with that shipwreck, yeah. it's a wrap. <laughs> Hey, so real quick, I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a quick, uh, a quick vote, man, because I do still see six people tuned in. Now, y'all two are, y'all two are in the chat. I assume that y'all count as viewers too, or that doesn't count in that count, or I'm not sure how that works. We still got M3 watching. Okay. Oh, are they? Okay. So should, uh, should I extend it? Should I normally I, I quit at two o'clock? Should I extend it? Let's get uh, a vote uh, in the comment uh, section. And I ain't gonna be greedy since I only got six viewers right now. If I get two vo- two votes that say continued, then we'll stretch it out a little bit longer. <laughs> two hey, people. Let me hear. It. Let me hear it. two yeses, and we keep going. Uh, I'm, I'm off tomorrow anyway, so it's all good in the hood, bro. So. Uh, I mean, if I don't get, get a vote or what, man? I mean, if I don't get them two yeses, if I don't get them two yeses, man, we're gonna go private and we're gonna we're gonna show all the cool shit in our private chat with each other. <laughs> and y'all gonna have to catch y'all gonna have to catch it later. Y'all gonna catch it next week. <laughs> Goddamn, you still doing tomorrow? Come on, party people, hit that yes, man. I, okay, so I think we got two. Yeah, we got M three and we got Jay Holler. That's what's up. All right. Jay Holler must not be going to Target in the morning. Or shit, he might still. He's just going to stay up until Target opens anyway. (laughs) He's going to be watching the live stream out in front of Target. Hell yeah. I'm watching. I'm over here watching Transformers on Twitch. There's a channel on Twitch that just runs all every Transformer. Every, every, every Transformer media every man. Twitch channel and running the reruns 24/7. So right now it's the G1 episodes. Then they do Beast Wars, and they'll go through the Beast War era. Then they go to the Japanese, and then every cartoon that's been made after they'll do the movies. And go right back to G one after it's all it's a it's a whole full run. So like, just loops it. Yeah. Loops it watch, uh, yep. all, all, day. all them shits on uh Tubi TV, a free app, man. All the Transformers. Okay. That's I need to get my kids on Transformers, man. The old G one and shit. Yeah. 
they loop them, they loop them. Like I said, they give you all of it. Like they even do it like chronologically. So like Old school G.I. Joe cartoon, too. they'll give you season one, season two, show you the eighty six movie, season three, and season four, and then go into Beast Wars. And then oh, okay. they even show the movie then. That's what's they up. Do, they do the Michael Bay movies too. Oh, all, no shit. All on Twitch, twenty four seven. They'll run the whole gamut and then do it all over again every day. That's what's up, man. Yeah. You know, uh, so, Input tried to show the movie on his channel, and uh, YouTube shut him down. Oh yeah, YouTube ain't having none of that. They did. They shut us down for Transformers the movie. We tried to do it too, and they yeah. shut us down. They, uh, I got flagged because I did a voiceover. Yeah, it was fun times. <laughs> yeah, and they, they did some. I think they took the the, the music out of it or some shit. They, they uh, yeah, they took the audio off of the video. We try to do like a DVD commentary live. We we kept the volume low, but it didn't matter. They they shut us off at like five minutes, and we got a sixty day ban. <laughs> so, Damn. Yeah, man, you can't do. Yeah, you can't play other people's shit. But the crazy part is, if we would have recorded it and uploaded it, that'd have been okay. Because I've seen other people do it. Yeah. But if you did it live. That's a no-no. I'm like, what's the fucking difference? Yeah. But hey, my wife, my wife uh, was watching. She was trying to watch uh, basket one of these one of these damn love and hip hops or some shit. She was trying to watch it on YouTube, and the camera, like the camera's all dancing around and it's cropped. Like it'll play 20 seconds of audio and then it'll clip off and it'll be missing five seconds and come back on. She's like, why is it doing all that shit? And I'm like, man, they're trying to trying to avoid a copyright uh, or whatever. Jay Holla, that Twitch channel is just called it's called Only Transformers. <laughs> only Transformers. Yeah, if you it's uh, on Twitch, it's called Only if Transformers. If you desync the audio and the video, that will help uh, disguise it. I got a Twitch channel too, man. I need to because you can multi-stream between YouTube and Twitch, can't you? Yeah, you can. Yeah. <clears throat> I need to get with that shit, man, because that might be another way to pick up, pick up a whole new, whole new group of folks, man. <clears throat> I had made a twist. We we did a couple, of, like we were fucking around with uh, GTA online, I think, and Red Dead Redemption. What what system are you playing yeah. on? On the PS4. I got I got the PS4, the Xbox One, and the Nintendo Switch. Okay. I ain't gonna jump on the five bandwagon until probably next Christmas, man. Nah, bro, I'm waiting till those till all the betas get done and and, yeah. you know, and they get the real console, the finished product. Just the just the fucking beta console. Yeah. Right now, I, I don't I don't dip into new consoles until at least year two, year two of they cycle. Yeah. Uh, I don't fuck with year one. Ah. <laughs> uh, yeah. It, as far as like if if you're into and in, if you're into the hacking the jailbreaking community kind of scene or whatever then a, a day one system is good for that because because they have you know you can get er, early firmware to be a you know whatever exploits they have are vulnerable yeah but i, I kind of feel like those days are over man because all, all the games are digitally downloaded now or just about so I think them days of jailbreaking systems are about shot. Oh yeah, look that that ended with the PlayStation Four with uh, the systems having to be online all the whole time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they they be, they be trying to shut those cats, the modders, and all those people down, man. Hey, but that GTA when we played with the mods on that shit, man, that shit's so lit. Yeah, they got that shit looking like real life, using the real model cars and all that shit. I'm like, damn, I wish I had that kind of skill to do that shit. Dude, that shit was tight. And all the cheats and shit, man. We, we was on that bit. We making it rain, making it rain money on people and shit, man. Shit, there's one for uh, GTA Five or something where uh, it'll give you like a Goku skin or a Superman. Oh yeah, yeah. <clears throat> they got Optimus Prime on GTA. Oh yeah, they got mods of everything on GTA, yep. bro. Like yep. you can turn yourself into Iron Man, Spider Man. Yep. 
That's that's okay. like ultimate game, man. That's the ultimate game right there. They got a mind. You can turn into the Green Goblin and then ride on the on the glider <laughs> through Los Santos. Yep. You can do all you that shit, Hulk. bro. You can be the Hulk on that shit. Spider Man. Anybody? Yeah. yeah, they done they done bust the GTA wide open, boy. See, they keep just bringing it to the next console. Like, how old, how old is this, you know, GTA now? That's just, like, almost 10 years old. Yeah, yeah, I believe so, man. And, you know, shit, they got a new island coming out for it on the 15th of December. For real? Yeah. Yep. There's a whole new island being added to it. Oh, shit. I know they added a new heist, but I didn't know about the island. Yeah. Hey, me and my homeboy Bruce, we got so damn good at them heights, man. We be killing that shit, man. How much? How much money you got on your character? <laughs> oh, man, I'm shit. We uh, the hack account like billions <laughs> and trillions. <laughs> the hack, yeah, the hack account yeah. billions. Yeah, yeah, but like the normal one, I probably got shit, yeah. shit man. I probably got like 10, 10, 12, 13 million, some shit like that, probably. My son plays it all the time now, and he don't really. He just he just spends it on ammo. He don't buy cars and shit. He just loves to shoot at people. <laughs> <laughs> That's his whole thing. It, and the court, we had to stop him from going to the strip club. He's five, but he already. <laughs> oh, don't tell don't tell him about the Playboy Mansion. Uh, I'm sure he's found it already. <laughs> He's picking up them uh, hookers, man. Right? I, I told I told my friend about that shit the other day. They didn't know about it. They was like, "Yo, show me that shit." What? Like, he didn't believe me. I was like, "Yo, they be naked, topless bitches in the grotto." Yeah. And the party pop off at night. You gotta yeah. go there at night. He be popping off. Up. He went during the daytime. Nobody was there. I said, "Yeah, nobody's gonna be here. You gotta wait till the nighttime." And yeah. pop off, and he's like, "All right, man, we ain't going nowhere. We hanging out to the day." Yeah. <laughs> like 15, 20 minutes later, he was like, "Oh shit, that bitch got no top on." <laughs> like I told you. So I, I, caught, I caught my son. I caught my son. He kept going in the strip club. He goes, he try to leave every time I come in the room. <laughs> Like, bro, you standing on the block. You can't be front like you wasn't in there. <laughs> you know, I got on. I got on that flying motorcycle, the oppressor. I flew his ass clear across the city. I was like, "Don't you go back to that? Don't you go back to that again? Come back a couple minutes later. He done flew back to it." <laughs> be like your ass, stay in the town. You better stay in the downtown area. <laughs> yeah, for real. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Well, he done dropped the GPS pin and everything there. Yeah, yeah, he knows where that shit is at, boy. That's burning his memory. <laughs> that's right, that's why. that's why your character is broken now. He be, he be making it rain up right there. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, why, why my money low? You gonna check your, you gonna check your phone check one day, you gonna see all the strippers of your friend. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you can buy all the phone house. Strong. He got strong relationships with all of them. <laughs> you gonna look at your phone like, wait, Misty, Candy, Sandy? I don't know these bitches get on my phone. <laughs> I'm trying to call the mechanic. Yeah, I ain't spending money on ammo. <laughs> <laughs> he ain't spending money on ammo. <laughs> Man, yeah. But yeah, they're coming out with that island, man. I'm, I th- I'm gonna crank it back up to see what they, see what they done added to it, man. Why not? In fact, the last two times I played GTA, I went to the casino, spin the wheel, and won the car <laughs> twice already. Now. Oh yeah. Yeah, the last car they had was that fucking race car. I was like, what the fuck am I gonna do with this shit? <laughs> hey, boy, we, uh, me and my buddy, we got the the mods on that shit. We can win the car every time. And the lottery machines, we can. We, uh, what, uh, I can't remember how much. Uh, I think it was two hundred fifty thousand. You could hit for every time on the machine or some shit like that. And and we could every time we play, we hit the jackpot. The crazy bread, man! Stupid bread. 
stupid. Making money rain off bad money bags just falling on people. It's in my videos. I was posting all my videos. I got banned on one of the accounts. I had to make another one. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm not surprised, Casual. You you cheated on a transforming competition. <laughs> <laughs> yep, me and Bruce were racing, transforming. Uh, it was Dirge and uh, is it Dirge? Not. Yeah, yeah, it was Dirge and Ramjet. We were racing, transforming. I just took the arms off of him. I took the arms off of him and folded that shit up real quick. He ain't even see it at first. <laughs> <laughs> I said, I can't lie to you, man. I took the arms off. <laughs> Finished that shit too quick. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Yeah, he'll he'll probably be back on his channel Tuesday. He's he skipped the streams this week, but he'll probably be back on his jet this Tuesday. Yeah, and I find all the, yeah yeah. And Pop Pop has a valid point. I always find all the, the hidden modes <coughs> in the toys because I can't figure out how to transform it the appropriate way. I come up with third modes. <laughs> the third mode. Yeah, they triple changes. Hasbro don't like y'all to know that shit. <laughs> <laughs> they don't want y'all to know that shit. So yeah, triple change in that. One. Yeah, because then then y'all to start buying three of the damn toys. Try because I, I didn't show you the yeah, secret yeah. mode. Good video on uh, secret modes and stuff was uh, Bumble Breeze. Bumble Breeze. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I haven't checked out his videos in a second. I need to see if he's still fucking around. Yeah. Look, I was actually uh, uh, on Bumble Breeze's channel before I even made a video or did YouTube. Man, there's so many good YouTubers. It's hard to watch everybody, man. This is, man, shit. That's why I just gave up on, I gave up on regular TV. Regular TV's trash, man. And just watch real people on YouTube. Listen, you know, you find yourself going down some rabbit holes, man. If you find something that catches your interest for like five or ten minutes. Yeah. I got to watch that Mando tomorrow, man. Oh, this week's episode is good. I ain't going to spoil it for you, bro. Shit, Bruce didn't spoil it already. Oh, he did? Oh, he did. Man. Of course he did. But yeah, it's, it's a good episode, though. Bill, Bill Burrow killed it. He killed it again. So, damn yeah, man, yeah, I got. Man, I, I ain't got the uh, Disney Plus for this channel or, or for this season. Mando, I watched the first season though. Holy shit! What do you got cool. there, man? Is that Scorpion? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, okay, all right. Yeah, I was just fucking with it. His head fell off, <laughs> so I was like, oh. I still ain't open my joint up yet. Yeah, I had to, man. Scorpionock's one of those figures I've been waiting for them to make this motherfucker, man. Yeah, they make you go through everybody else before they finally make the one you want. So he, he was a he was a long time coming. And I'm, I'm glad I'm glad they 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 did him right though. They didn't they didn't half ass it, so Yeah, man. Hey, it was hard for me to get him too, man. Money was super tight when, when he was coming out. But I was like, man, I done got all the other Titans. How am going to skip this one? See, I don't have all the Titans. The only one I'm missing right now is uh, is Metroplex. Damn, got, boy, he's I the got, hardest one to get. I got, I got four packs. I got, uh, I got um, Trypticon. I skipped out on the Omega Supreme because I got the third party from Fan Toys. Okay, yeah, that ain't that bad. That's a good one too. Yeah, he's a fucking beast. He's like a, he's, he's literally like a small child. Yeah, like you could put him in a car seat. <laughs> but um, but yeah, Metroplex, I missed out on. I, I was hoping they would re-release him someday because I definitely would pick it up. Hey, he's like, he's like yeah, three or four hundred dollars now. Yeah, he, yeah, he's he's going for for crazy in the aftermarket. Damn, boy. I'm glad I got him. I couldn't pass out on them, man. Them big-ass Transformers, I, I got to have it. 
I'm, I'm mad about that Unicron in the HasLab. I want that shit too, but there was no way I could pull it off. Yeah, but I got that that third party one coming in soon. How much that run you know for real, for real? Like three three eighty or around that. Damn, bro. And he's smaller than the HasLab, ain't it? Uh, Cell Studios. Yeah, yeah, he's a little bit smaller, but I think he looks better though. He's a lot cleaner than the HasLab. Yeah. Plus, I, it's like 18 I inches. smaller is better because I, I ain't got that much real estate. Like I got this dude right here. Uh, yeah. So that's a big motherfucker. Here. So, like I said, I ain't got, I ain't got real estate, bro. Smaller is better, man. <laughs> what, who told you that? Got that shit. My homeboy Bruce has got that one. Or not that, not that paint. I don't think it's that paint scheme, though. Yeah, this was the, the uh, cartoon cooler accurate one. Yeah, his his is real close to it, but I think the chest plate and all is just silver. Yeah, that was the first version. This is the second version they put out. Damn, that shit's mean, too, boy. What's, what's the brand? Uh, this one actually actually on sale for, like, like, I think, like, 350 Damn, that's big, boy. It usually ran about 500 so, so. Now is that the uh, that's the all built in combiner parts, Bruticus? Yeah, but you see the, the Zeta toys. This is from Zeta toys. They actually do parts for them. So like this whole area, like the legs, the thigh, all this is like parts for them. This part here, and you just add the figures. So it's like yeah, like this is all the shell. Cause like I, like I got the I got um. It's a uh, Superion, the Aerial Bot one. I haven't popped them out of the box yet, though, because I need to find space. See, that's like cheating, though, man. They, they've built a skeleton that you just plug the figures into. Well, not you get the uh, built-in combiner parts. Um, right now, everybody, all the third parties, are doing parts forming. Some they, they've stepped it up to that. Now they fucked it up a bit. They get Superion. I love this that big ass box. Hold on a second. Yeah. Hold on a second. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, I, I took it outside because I was fucking with it, trying to transform it. But then I put it back in the box because too many pieces. Yeah, the, the aerial bot one, that's mean too, though. I like Jimmy Lee shit again. God damn it, Jay, my fucking shit back. That's better. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm a. I'm probably gonna. It's probably only gonna go about eight more minutes. I, I gave another thirty minutes to the stream. I still gotta. I still gotta go in here and spend time with the with my wife here. I think I still hear them rustling about. <laughs> but we're gonna wait for Mr. Smith to, to get done so we can formally sign everybody oh, out man. here. Happy wife, happy wife, man. Hell yeah. Hey, John Simmons, yeah, appreciate you tuning in, man. Uh, Mr. Smith, I believe we're gonna be we're gonna go ahead and round it up, man. We gave another thirty minutes into the stream. We gave him some some extra footage. So yeah, we're gonna wrap it up, man. Everybody that's still here, subscribe to these guys if you catch it later. Subscribe to these guys if you ain't already subscribed. Like the video, all that hoopla. Catch me again next Friday, 10.30 p.m. Eastern Time until 2 a.m. in the morning. We, we may have these guys back on the show. I don't know. We'll see where, where they're at in life uh, when Friday comes. <laughs> I see. I see. This is what I'm talking about. Look, I'm trying to I'm trying to come down there to casual custom creations uh, uh, to the studio floor there. <laughs> Let's all do it live. Do it live. Creations is with a C. <laughs> all right, your boy Smith Super Awesome Reviews.
Yeah, uh, yeah. I was, uh, the, well, real quick, well, the aerial box. So that's the sure, the sure, sure, sure. Yeah, see, that's the, the the main body. Then you would plug the leg, the, the two robots here. Yeah. This part flips up to plug in the arms, and then you put the main body in the cavity. Yeah. So it's kind of parts forming, but it, it makes for a more masterpiece scale. Yeah, it makes for a better looking. Uh, it looks kind of like the cartoon. It makes it look more like the cartoon kind of. Okay, well, yeah. shit, man. Well, why don't we just buy a Gundam kit, like perfect grade, and we'll just slap some uh, uh, deluxes onto it. No. Uh, yeah. He's got a valid point. He's got a valid point. But nonetheless, it's still done. Yeah, that's uh, what done. yeah. Yeah. But it still makes a hell of a looking, a great looking combiner, man. Better than what Hasbro gave us. And they give you like this uh, robot head here. That shit's nice. And then you get a more cartoon accurate head. Oh. I think I'd go with the robot head personally. Which one are you going with? Uh, I'm keeping I'm keeping the cartoon accurate, bro. Okay, okay. Keep it cart keep it G one. For me the robot head looks dofer. See, that's what I'm always trying to look for is uh, tune accuracy. That shit looks good, though, boy. Yeah. So, they got a lot of they got a lot of kibble on the back. Though. Shit, that's the aerial bots, though. They they got yeah. shit hanging off the back anyway. Yeah, so. that's how they're supposed to be. Like I said, I got a guy. Find some yep. time in my day, like to sit back and just fuck with these things. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what it, make, it makes you want to buy two sets of them so that you can you can display the bot modes and the combiner. Bro, if I had that money, shit. I already know. You already know. I think. Hey, because they're like, I think we all have that same mindset as collectively. If we had that kind of money, we would have two of everything. Yeah. Yeah. Them shits, those man, them shits are good. They they'd be good master to stand like masterpieces. Yeah, they they scale yeah, they scale with them. Yeah, it'd be perfect. <laughs> well, yeah. don't worry. There's, there's gonna be a video of these bro these these bad boys coming soon. So, well, I'm definitely gonna watch, man. I'm definitely gonna watch. I want to see more of them. That's why I ain't hung up the video yet. <laughs> you keep pulling them out. I'm going to keep watching. This <laughs> one, he's trying to transform himself over here. I got to put him back in so I can get him back in the box. <laughs> they say, yeah, they say they're getting out, boy. They're getting out tonight. They go. They go. Unite and escape. <laughs> they said they're gonna beat Bruticus ass. That looks real good, man. Yeah, man. The good shit, bro. Like I said, options, man. It's good to have options. Hey, they look so good. I'd I'd really be torn between what modes to pose them, man. For real, it be like that sometimes. <laughs> Damn, because I'm like the combined mode is good. Like that's why I'm like, damn, if I had that kind of money, I would go in on a second set just to have shit. If I had that money, I go in three sets: one for robot, one for jet mode, one for yeah. combined mode. Yeah, because I bet the jet modes look good too, man. Yeah, they clean, man. They clean, and it really feels G one too, man. It feels it feels like you're looking at the G one toy in front of you. They, 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 it gives you that 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 feels. Like, yeah, like you're five years old again. Yeah. <laughs> the last one. 
It's gonna be kind of tough. I would've got this, boy. I would've got him if I had the money, man. That's what I be saving for, man. I, I like said, so, your boy. I don't, I don't, I don't buy a lot of other things. <laughs> I, li- I live on that ramen. I live on that ramen lifestyle. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Shit. I dig it, man. I dig it. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't, I ain't ashamed to shop at Food Depot. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes you got to save 50 bucks. <laughs> so. yep. You got to make it do what it do. <laughs> All right, well, I am going to wrap it up. I'm going to get in here with the missus, man, before she get, get mad at me. Yeah, ramen noodles right. is about to find me with some places. Yeah, I fucked with ramen. I fucked with ramen, man. All right, fellas, well, we're going to close it out, man. Again, thank everybody for tuning in. Y'all subscribe to these people. These guys are some great dudes. <laughs> All right, fellas, I'm going to catch y'all later, man. I hope y'all have a good evening, man. Yeah, yeah, man. So, all right, y'all be good now. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and with that, we all. All right, casual. Appreciate you, all man. Right. Yeah, man. Yep. yep. Always fun, man. All right, <laughs> all right catch y'all later. All right, man. All right, peace man. out, bro. All right.